Huh? Oh, we're just opening with that. <clears throat> yep. Hey, what's, what's up? up? <clears throat> hey, how are you? Audience? I assume we're the lights on. You're I can't you're see. You're on camera. Oh, we're over yeah, there. Yeah, we there. can't see that one. Hey, oh. this is off topic. Uh, joining us this week, I'm your host, Michael. We got Fredo, Matt Bragg. <laughs> And Gavin Free, uh, it, it's gonna have to lower that. Yeah, yeah it's that, you can hear that very well. Time. We uh, should put that on that. If you, but then uh, have to turn around. Well, put it, I'll put it on both. both. Okay. Yeah, now, well, then they can watch. I can that. see what you're doing. Uh, so, you so if see. you watch the stream today, uh, so there's thanks sponsors for this episode, right? We got we got Movement, Blue Apron, Casper. You're gonna love this one. Uh, so the Achievement Hunter stream today. Matt is trying this, uh, this like crazy hard Mario Maker two level. It's dog it's shit! It's, it hit hot. It hit it's hot. It's called on Mario the one one with a twist, but I think the name got cut off. I think it should be a twist of AIDS. Oh, I thought <laughs> it was, I was going to say absolutely. I thought when it said "but with a twist," it meant testicular torsion. Oh, so it's just twisting kind of, yeah. your oh. nut until it explodes. Uh, damn it! So Matt's been playing it for two hours. It's just basically a hell level. Mm -hmm. Matt played it for two hours straight. He got a little more than halfway through. He made it about twenty-five seconds in at one point. Yeah, it's, which it, is about halfway. It takes about on a fifty second yeah, forty-seven seconds. seconds or so, I think, to beat the level. Oh, looks like uh, insanity, but there's a rhythm to it for sure. It. Yeah, and he's got it. And so we had to end the stream, but he he really wants to beat it. But he's Dude. also getting. Drunker well, we'll as see. he plays. He's not yet, yeah, but then he'll reach yet. that yeah. sweet spot. That you know, is so right where he tips to me over. in my body, in my blood, uh -huh. there is a probably 15 to 18 minute window of immense mm -hmm. getting really good at playing SWAT <laughs> after you get tipsy and then you go too far <laughs> and then you lose yeah. it. But there's like yeah, a little tiny part. window where I can or read about just, everything slows down just yeah. a bit and you can see I the can coding. Win two games of SWAT before I've gone too far. Do you think Matt has that window? We're gonna find out. Oh man. Okay, Matt, that's the best I can do for you. I got it on the iPad. Thank you, man. Um it, I can't full screen it though. So the the strategy we were using with Matt trying to complete this level is uh we pulled up a video of someone who had beat it. Yeah. And Gavin was on keyboard controls. Every time Matt, after a hundred or two hundred deaths, would, would clear a section and and log it in his brain. Then he would just like constantly replay the next section of the video, so you at least know what you have to do. I mean, we watched a video of someone beat it, and Matt's halfway through in two hours. Yeah. So it's not really like, oh, I'll just watch the so video. So in theory, by the end it. of the podcast, he's at the finish. That's what I'm saying. He's more than halfway there. Halfway through. The What's he drinking that's gonna slow him down? Uh, uh Johnny. Johnny Walker. Johnny Walker. Double Walker. black. Oh, Dude, some man. of this shit towards the middle is insane. I mean, that's where he is, though. That's where he's getting to. Matt, yeah, but like the, the next middle. part. Right no, no, middle. but oh, like, to the middle. Hey, the like, next part, that's towards the end. No, there's oh, a lot. It is. He's well, more I'm than halfway there. The, where, I'm, where I'm seeing Matt die, the next series of jumps is absolutely nuts. He's talking about the blocky middle? Matt yeah, really well, just, the, Matt just tickled the beginning of the blocky part. That's really what he needs so he to do. He has to go back, now, and then he goes under, and then, then he, he goes over that. and back in. The real challenge is, it. couldn't can we make right a podcast this, around this? this. That's what we, the that answer's passes. probably no. But I feel you just gonna, did it for two hours. It's gonna exist anyway. Yeah, but there was no option to like download the audio of what we just did. Mm. There is for this. <laughs> People are just gonna yeah. be like, I hate this. So you just gotta make sure you're like, Matt jumped over a thing. Oh, Matt got killed by a thing. Cause then they know. Yeah, describe without, the whole level. A lot of people watch this during, you know, or they listen during a commute, right? They're not gonna mm -hmm. run to their computer to watch the video of Matt beating right. it. So we'll have to make sure we bring them along. Yeah, I'll keep my eye on it. <laughs> okay. Pretty much if, if I'm swearing, just right, know I died. died. Matt died. Fucker. Just died. I mean, yeah, it's just every like couple minutes, just, oh, Matt died again. Can just, we just have someone in broadcast in ring there. a bell every time he dies? Please, <laughs> no. No. So that would be fucking mine. The bell is glued oh. to your desk right now. That's true. <laughs> the, the bell is immovable. <laughs> I think there might have been like some sort of effect there where if we made Matt ring the bell, it might encourage him to beat it. Because he wouldn't want to How often do you think it? he wouldn't ring the bell? Oh, wow. I wouldn't he would ring just it completely off. ignore the fucking bell. Until like the end where I ring it with my fucking forehead. <laughs> <laughs> the one time over. <laughs> the bell wow. comes up wow. with your head. That's when you beat it. So that's the final ring. Damn. Yeah. Knock yourself out. Go and the death the is me on the inside. So we, uh, this is uh, basically who's left in Achievement Hunter that's not at San Diego Comic Con. This weekend, San Diego. San Diego. Even Comic Eric's Con. gone. Even Eric's gone. He wouldn't be here anyway, but no. yeah, he'd be in the building somewhere. Comic Con's happening right not now. Not producing this show. Doubt there's anything Marvel related going to happen. They'll probably hold that off for D23, but I'm hoping. What, what is, is on? The, I don't the, 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 the What the What's final? up? What? I'm right here. Liar. Yeah. 
Come here. I'm over here. Come here. Laya. No. Yeah, fuck you. <laughs> Piece of shit. What was there's happening? A, there's a, a soundboard of him. There has it's to be. Eric. It's them covering for Eric. Uh, yeah. It's like fucking Ferris Bueller. You just see, all you <laughs> see is <laughs> just an arm wave through the door. Yeah. It's like, no, 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 step no, out first. Hey, Eric, what's your favorite kind of fish? I don't know. <laughs> Damn, they got you. They showed you. Is this literally um, a fucking how do we stop? We gotta, we gotta break the soundboard. They put more work into the soundboard than any than show he's ever produced. produced. Yeah. yeah. Why yeah, the gotta fuck? Gotta go to a meeting. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Why, yeah, yeah, yeah. Why would he just? So board? did we even hire Shit. Eric, or do we just buy the rights to the soundboard from him? <laughs> now we're good. <laughs> oh boy. There's gotta be a way to stump that. Besides knowing he's not here. Eric, I want pi to nine decimal places. Oh, he went to a meeting, didn't he? Yeah, he left already. Uh, I, mean, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> also, yeah, that, that's the same thing. I mean, you can at least ask okay, him. He can record also a different I don't know. Yeah. Right? <laughs> I don't know. Okay. <laughs> what? Right, that was good. That was Are I you don't serious? Know too. I don't know. <laughs> good take, Eric. What a turd. What That's, an absolute it's not fucking bad, wow. wow. When did they do this? Have they played fucking that before? Has he ever been here happened. before? <laughs> yeah. I feel like I talk to him every week, but I never see the bastard. <laughs> That's crazy. If I, didn't I don't know, know what's real for sure anymore. he wasn't here because I literally saw him earlier this week. I'm like, hey man, I'm excited for Friday. And he yeah, went, I won't be here. They could have pulled that off. I would have believed too? he was yeah. here. 100% really would have believed he was here. That would have worked. That would have. Because it sounds exactly like he sounds. That's insane. That's what recordings are. That's good ADR. Sure. That's good ADR. It's like they've replicated what it actually sounds like. Was well, in they're playing it through the same speakers they usually do. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. They've pulled it off. <laughs> they have the technology. <laughs> Dude, Jeff is uh, at Comic Con. He's like slack me right now. He just discovered uh, Titans and Doom Patrol. And he's like he found them there or no like the, through the uh, oh, around, right? through the he's what's it, DC the DC Unlimited. He's watching it through the app. Like, you know, oh, get the show. Through, yeah, watching the show Titans and Doom Patrol, and he's he's fuck loving Batman. it. Yeah, <laughs> fuck Batman. That's just, that's <sighs> the Titans show is fuck Batman. Titans show. is very gory and brutal. And they and Robin and says blood. F Batman. Like they fuck people up, and I mean, like, people die and get burnt. burnt. Like Starfire is like, <laughs> like torturing people. Yeah, well, she shit. like shoots fire beams and shit. Yeah, but like, like space this, beams. But to see, you know, like a super dark green. Use that thing, shit, right? It's crazy. Melt a face. If you're a superhero and your power is melt people, you like, what are you gonna do? Not melt people. It's true. How do you points. get around that? Maybe it's like it's like in all the, the Ninja Turtles oh. cartoons and movies. They're like hitting people with the back of their swords. I'm like, cut that guy in half. <laughs> cut that man in half. <laughs> You're holding two fucking giant swords and you keep knocking people out. <laughs> Chop them up. Why bring the goddamn sword? It's like the, it's just like the shotgun effect. Like, yeah. it's like if I run at people with two swords, maybe they'll just surrender. <laughs> I mean, they probably would. That maybe, is like a lot of shit. Maybe. Oh my god, I'm dead. Tone it down. <laughs> Give them like a first degree burn. Maybe tone it down. Give him a grappling hook. Yeah. The thing is, like, if you give someone like a fifth degree burn, which is incineration, they're not going to come back and fucking deal with you later. Oh, can you just make like your? Can you like time down? Just make like your fucking thumb like really heat up and then just like burn off. The so eyelid. you have to burn like, just people, like, eyelid. thumb width at a time. You're like, <laughs> no, can, like you know, if, like if you want to torture <laughs> someone, could you just like burn just like just the eyelid? It's wrong. It's your feet. You just cut just the. The tip of their penis off. It's like when Dr. Manhattan gives himself his logo. Yeah. Talking about penis. Yeah, he, he hangs dong in that. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I mean yeah. most people have one. They don't just hang it out. The first penis on Mars. And dance around. That we know of. Is, is that what he's like super well known for? That's I, what I took for the movie. I'm the first <laughs> penis penis on Mars. 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 Like, Woo! Mars! <laughs> this... One guy in the theater. First thing on Mars! <laughs> This is much harder. That was like TV. that was shocking. His penis, just yeah. dick, just like dick, not in like a comedy, right? Because when, when else? It's not a comedy. It wasn't a sex scene. It's like that guy's dick's just or out. The, it's just, or you see it's dick in dick's like out. like HBO stuff, like yeah, yeah but like, not a movie, yeah, but like darker, serious things. Yeah, but that's like war, s- like World War Two shit with dicks. It's not very really funny. Yeah. To see, I, I think, I think it's, I think it's funny jarring about a penis. because it's like a comic book movie. A penis in a concentration like a camp graphic is novel never movie. funny. Yeah, but well, again, again, like, even then, even, I don't know, even then though, like, in that, so it's the same thing with like Oz, <laughs> it's HBO, like Oz and Dick's only, but you're in prison, people are naked, then your it's dicks true. are out. Echo's dick. Dr. Manhattan, it's like, there's no need 
for his dick to have been out. It could have just been had underwear on or something. Someone was just like, what if his dick was out? To no, be fair, it's to be fair Michael, it's the, the, the character's transcended all of time yeah, and matter. Yeah. And and it's just like, me? why would I cover it? Because yeah, it's character. comic books, that's all. Because every comic book you could say that. Why the fuck does Superman wear any goddamn clothes? He's fucking Superman. Well, he's he still, he's what he's still he's alive. Alive. He's he's alive. Dude, I would love to be alive. Cut off your tackle flopping in the window. I mean, get ripped off. I would he love to be a superhero. You could use that argument with anybody. Can you imagine? I would cover my dick and just have the dick. Re-entry Earth's atmosphere, burning up with your penis out. It'd be all over well, the place. Let's all your be honest, I don't think the clothes are, clothes are doing shit for you. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Right. It's still going nuts. That's he doesn't right. have like. He doesn't have a helmet on. He doesn't yeah. have fucking. <laughs> like your skin, your hands, or he's. That's not burning off. Your penis is fine. Can you space. imagine I'm Superman just saying, with I'm a just helmet? Off the top that would take of my head, a lot away from you know, it, right? You know who doesn't give a shit about nothing? Thanos. He wasn't floating around with his cock hanging out. The guy wanted to destroy half the universe. He was just like, you know, I'm all about like resources and some that. Why was he wearing clothes? I mean, no but, reason I, because it's, you just don't watch a movie with with cocks everywhere. At the same time, I'm I mean, not like, arguing against it. I'm just saying it was like, whoa, that guy's dick's out, and he can get as big as he wants. <laughs> what if Rorschach just took his dick out? Like, it, that would make a tiny it, Rorschach. Yeah, just that like, would make yeah. his, his <laughs> dick like, like, a, like a lava lamp dick. Yeah. What if he was <laughs> like, you're in here with this, and then he took it out. It's a weird his, movie. his dick would be angry. <laughs> Dude, I bought that movie. I'm looking forward to the series. I bought that movie on Blu-ray, and I accidentally bought like the director's cut. Shit. It's like three and a half hours long. It's so long. And there's Shit. all this animated part. All the Black Freighter shit is in there. Oh, yeah. It's long. That was available. I saw that on like Amazon. You yeah. You get that version. But usually there's an option to like watch the normal one. And either so I missed it, that or... Does it like... Where is that animated thing at? It's all throughout. Oh. Whenever they cut to the kid like sat down on the street, the two, the two dudes. Oh, then that's when it goes into. You're doing it, man. You're doing it. Not still playing, by the oh, way. Damn it. Good try. You can still hear the like subtle moans and groans and the <laughs> click clack of the controller. <laughs> There's some good shit cut from that though. There's some like, like a penis? good stuff that makes sense later. Like a uh, night owl, original night owl gets killed, and a uh, new night owl gets really pissed off, and it sort know. of makes sense that his character gets more angry throughout the movie. But I think that's oh. cut from the original. Who yeah. was the original Night Owl? Was he like Baby Owl? Hollis Mason. Mm. I, I, think he, I think he was looking movie. for the name. <laughs> Not like who, who he was. Who did he get promoted but like... from? <laughs> what do you mean? Well, because the other guy was Night Owl. Who was he? The mm -hmm. guy from Aquaman is but Night Owl 2. I, I'm just saying, I'm was Night Owl oh, yeah, 2 yeah. anyone yeah. before Night Owl, Owl 1 was dead? Where he was just waiting for him to die. No, Generally, no, they, there's no, like a just promotion retired. system. Yeah, he just, just retired, retired ages ago. Oh. Oh, so they okay. used to like get together and tell stories about how they were both night out. Gotcha. Yeah. I've oh. seen the movie one time. Uh, yeah, it's... and it was the <clears throat> weekend it came out. <laughs> so what? Like, <laughs> it was, yeah, it was if, like if it was one of the weirdest oh, movies I'd ever walked in to see because I'm just like, oh, comic book movie. I'm like, that wasn't what I thought it would be at all. <laughs> yeah, I there remember... was no crime fighting at all in that. What the hell was that? Everyone's just like <laughs> mad and pissed off. And yeah, it's like a fucking, movie like about retired superheroes. Yeah, mm -hmm. I knew nothing about it. I'm just like, I'll just go see this, and I'm like, that is a, there's a lot of plot in this. Look, it could be Mostly worse. plot. That's a moment. I told the story before already. Yeah, it could be worse where, could be Batman v Superman. No, you could be Jackie. I told the story before, but she went to go see the movie Nightcrawler, and then like at the end of the movie, <laughs> yeah, she was like, where the fuck is Nightcrawler? How do you say that at the end of the movie and not I 10 were, minutes did, in? Did I? No, we didn't go. That was. I remember doing the same. Thinking of the Nightcrawler X Men Origin that's, movie. That makes no goddamn <laughs> sense at all. No, that's, that's just beyond. Credits roll. It's like, <laughs> no, he never turned blue. He never. He never did. <laughs> Fredo, I God thought the same thing soul. going to see it, but then like about five minutes in, I was like, oh, this is something completely you different. You notice pretty quickly somewhere, somewhere towards the that end it's end. not that at all. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how how you can suspend belief like, in an entire wow, film. This it's is like, really dark. Oh, man. <laughs> I want them dark to make a movie. movie that's just named after each X-Men character, but nothing <laughs> X-Men at all. It's like a, a movie about Wolverines. <laughs> yeah, oh, the animal. The Where's the guy? The Where's Logan? Yeah. <laughs> Why? He's just not showing up. Just a bunch of little critters. Where's Claws? Never came. Storm would be easy. <laughs> Professor X is the one you're gonna struggle with. <laughs> yeah. Oh my. Oh damn it. Oh, Matt died again. Damn it. Jeez. All those X's are just Matt. Yeah, they, they easily could adjust just his death. Did anyone see the new X Men? I didn't even see it. I this did. Am yeah. I good? Nope. Okay. I didn't because of you, Freda. It, it is fucking terrible. Um, it's bad. There's nothing good about it at all. Oh, at least you said. <laughs> so. Damn. Yeah.
glowing. Dude, it's really weird glowing too because in Apocalypse, right? In Apocalypse, it's just like okay, the way Apocalypse dies is you know she. <laughs> You better be up there, Jean man. Yeah, I know, I know where I'm meant to be, but I'm not. You know, and it's like, kills Apocalypse, and he's like, oh my goodness. And then in the Phoenix movie, the Phoenix Force is like, in space, and then goes into Jean Grey. And just like, that doesn't make any sense. What, so it's an alien thing? Yeah, it's like cosmic being that floats in there. Yeah. Is that what it always was? I believe so, yeah. Oh, okay. Yeah. I, she got through space. At least I remember from the Nights cartoon. There's different iterations, but yeah, I think that's the main. Yeah, I've never way like... it was. She obtained that. I feel like there's enough X Men movies to rank them in order of greatness. Oh, there's a ton. Well, I mean, after two, you really you could kind of start. I liked First Class. First Class was good. I thought that was a great one. Yeah, I don't know. I I the, vaguely remember the, the first. The three, first so. two were great for their time. They'd probably be pretty dated now. Yeah. Just just with like the Marvel Cinematic Universe, the superhero movies. I feel like they have a lot more to live up to now. I feel like the, the third one was just. The first Brett third Ratner one was taking a fucking poo terrible. The third on one was the role of film. Awful. He destroyed the franchise. <laughs> <laughs> like, they had to make first well, class to fix it. Was it Last Stand X yeah. three? Yeah, it was weird because was like they had awful. a storyline, and then the side story plot to that was like the, overtook it. Was the Phoenix Force? Like, it was all over the Phoenix place. Dude. It was like it was all over. How the place. is that? That's like one of the biggest like events in X Men history. I saw that in theaters. A like, I saw that weird. in theaters, and when they kill Cyclops like two minutes in the movie, I was just like, what? <laughs> I was so confused. I was like, I wonder how he's gonna come back. And then again, going back to like the Jackie thing, 30 minutes into the film, I went, he's not coming back. I didn't go, <laughs> I didn't do the credits roll, like, huh? I was just like, that's the movie? She's yeah. just going around and killing all the X-Men? What the fuck? Yeah, it's usually like, oh look, it's fucking, even at the end of the film would have been like, oh, it's just like, you're not in this movie. Yeah, it's and either that like, or like, oh, man. when is this dream sequence gonna end? It's yeah. been 25 minutes. Dude, I was pretty <laughs> convinced when she melted Professor X that that's where the movie was going. And I was just like, what is fucking yeah. happening here? And then they were like, oh, what do we do? I don't know, let's just make a Wolverine movie. Yeah, let's just <laughs> it. We're just gonna do an Origins movie of Wolverine. We don't know what to do with this. Dude, and then they had Deadpool, and then yeah, they that took was off. Away. They like yeah. covered his mouth. Yeah. They like, was, they made like, it. I was like, why? I don't really, you know, no shit about the comics or whatever, but it's like they went out of their way to go, fuck you. The guy's name is the Merc with the mouth. Yeah, and that's his like, big thing. They're like, we're going to break take your mouth you know? away. And it was like, what? <laughs> it was like, it was like they looked you. at the audience so and they were like, weird. yeah, fuck you. Fuck your stupid character. That was so bizarre. That was weird. What a weird world we live in, though, where like so much of that bled into the real world, where then Ryan Reynolds, like, champion. Like, because of that movie, if they didn't destroy that character like they did, we probably wouldn't have the good Deadpool movies. You're probably right. You know what yeah, I mean? Like, yeah. he, like, took that as, like, I will fix what I have helped create. <laughs> like, for fuck's sake, he kills that guy in, in Deadpool. In one, yeah. like, he goes back in time and you know, like, cross universes and kills the character that he plays. So funny. It's so fucking wild. So yeah. I can't, I look can't at wait the, to see. Look at the despair in Ryan Reynolds eyes where he's just like I what am I doing to this guy yeah. like oh. I love this character I think one of my favorite things so weird in Fuck. the Deadpool movies is when he's he signs his thing Ryan Reynolds yeah, yeah. it's just like so on the nose I love it I Some can't wait to see movies. him uh, make Green Lantern get again too <laughs> I never saw that see the thing is Green Lantern wasn't it wasn't Deadpool right That's like true. Green Lantern was just not good that's but, like, but, but the Green Lantern character was CGI. was fine yeah. the movie was just a piece of shit Wolverine wasn't terrible. Deadpool is easily the worst part about the entire fucking film. Mm -hmm. I was just like, why would you do that? Like, did he have like laser eyes and shit? Too? Well, they gave yeah, they gave him like a bunch of powers at the end. So he had like he had claws and he yeah. had Cyclops. Yeah, beams they, they threw he, like they all the just powers made him into, into like him ten different for no mutants reason. and then took away his face. Have you advanced any further, Matt, than the, the stream? Hell, no, uh, the new setup is a little different. I'm still learning. Oh fuck, dude! But There's, there are setbacks. Okay. Um, we we haven't made it less. Matt died. Far. Thanks. Matt, <laughs> hey, we gotta let the audience know. But even like, um, the first thing I think of with with the with the first X Men was it was just like exciting that there was Dude, a comic book so movie. Cool. Yeah, I remember thinking yeah. like, like I went to see all my favorite cartoon people 
in real life. Right. Like, they're and great then I was like, films Toad. now. Ooh, he's gross in real life. Darth Maul. <laughs> yeah, they're Darth great Maul. films sure. now. Like, you know, whatever. You know, you could not like the MCU. But, like, the, the budget and, like, the fucking action sequences, it's, like, you know, it's fucking top-tier movie making as far as, like, the work and, like, the visuals that go into it. Fucking 2000, it was like, I give him fucking claws. That's pretty cool. Like, that's... That's a special effect. Like knives come out of his fists, right? Who's doing that? And then they're like, like, like someone picking up a car would be like, what? You know. And then you watch the Avengers, and they're like blowing up the planet. You know, it's just like the scale is so insanely different. Can but you imagine if Endgame was the first superhero movie? It would be insane. It wouldn't. It wouldn't. Yeah. It wouldn't hit as hard though. It just wouldn't. It would just. You be, wouldn't have no emotional like, ties. Like, this is the whole character. fucking movie. You'd just be melting in your seat. Like oh, what the fuck is I, happening? I think you just sit there and be like, oh, there's that character. Oh, there's that character. Oh, there's that. And you have no, no emotional tie to the character. I don't even say emotional. But again, this is the scale of what you're watching. Yeah. It's like the fight scenes and the <laughs> aliens and whatever. Like, you know, again, fucking X-Men 1. It's like, oh shit, uh, Wolverine's in a fist fight with one guy. <laughs> it's a 1v1 <laughs> boxing match. This is crazy. You know, the Avengers, they're killing like 400 million aliens and shit. How does he yeah. stab through his own adamantium skeleton? What do you mean? Oh, fist, fists oh, are like, harder. Yeah, because he was like tied down via like metal because of Magneto. Well, he was like this, right? And yeah. he stepped through and himself stepped to get out. Through. But how did he get through himself? Stronger. Well, the rib cages. Perfect for that. I don't know. He, he believed. He believed. It. <laughs> yeah, it's you know. like, it's like, I hope these clothes don't hit my ribs. But it was like, the other know. thing was the was the that actor's physique at the time. You know, I feel like now we're in the most, like, you better, your body needs to die if you want to be, like, a big superhero <laughs> oh, yeah. character. You're going to live off of boiled like, chicken. dude, fucking and that's it. Hugh Jackman in X-Men 1 is just like, he's just some guy yep. that, like, you know, probably works out. That's it. Dude, yeah. Days of like, Future's past, Like, he's though. got no veins. You know, he's not like, Grr! like, at all times. Then you get to, like, the fucking Chris Evans, and you're like, what did you do to this man? <laughs> he used to be a normal man. <laughs> what have you done? Like, you literally super soldiered Chris Evans. <laughs> let this man live his life. Like, <laughs> let him eat a carb. <laughs> that's why he's so fucking happy to be, like, retired as Captain America. Like, I could be a human machine again. again. Yeah, you I feel know? like just any anything. Buff character who the actor has to buff up for, they just hate doing it. After like three times, like, I want to yeah. not do this. It's yeah. just, like Daniel Craig with Bond is like, I don't want to do it anymore. It, it's just That's not normal. It's, it's not, right. not your it's body just, is yeah. not intended. Human beings shouldn't be like that, right? There's just no way. It's, it's also dangerous. It's like, fucking, the stunts in those movies are pretty dangerous. Dude, speaking of stunts, we were talking about, before the podcast, you the uh, Top Gun Maverick trailer. Right. There's so, some shots in there of Tom Cruise in a fucking fighter jet. We know that he likes to just Produce his own stuff so no one can tell him not to do yeah. stunts. Yep, that's why that I started was producing him Mission taking Impossible. off from the aircraft carrier, right? Here's a shot of him in the plane, and he's like, and he like Dude, takes like a, yeah, off and he goes, wide shot. and it's like you actually feel like that was him in an actual plane. I'm not sure. I doubt he was flying it. He was probably just in the back of it. Well, yeah, so, it damn, insane, did it look real? Though. Do we, have a clip? we can't show that coming. Well, not with Matt. Probably not. I mean, you can. Yeah. It was just. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not going to well, feed it in the next uh, 50 years, probably. So. I feel like any. Is Tom there an Cruise... article in yeah, your broadcast that says if that's real or not? Every Tom Cruise movie, I just look out for the real stunt he did. And I assume it's. There was one he took one off, every right? Well, that's, that's what we're and, that's, about. and that's also, you like, it's such a thing, like. You hear about that again, going into like the fourth wall break of like the real thing becomes the thing for the movie. You know, like I don't remember shit about the Mission Impossible trailer, or like the like the last <laughs> one. Before I even saw the trailer, though, it's like I remember people going, "Yo, Tom Cruise is flying the helicopter in that scene. Like he's acting and in the, the one scene before and that, flying the like, helicopter. That's him on the side of the plane. Is right. Yeah. That had nothing to do with the plot of the movie. Yeah. That had nothing to do with like the build for the movie. It's like not fucking Ethan, whatever his name is. That's Tom, Tom Cruise yeah. is hanging on it's a plane. It's genius marketing because you just think like that itself just creates news. They don't have to do any promotion. Yeah. It's just like, hey, yeah. that's really him on a yeah. plane, and then you're like, I'm gonna see that. He yeah. did the. Um, that's actually that, a really good idea. He yeah. Did that we should. Our life. The mummy, <laughs> that wild ass mummy movie that had nothing to do with the I mummy. never saw it. I really wish it that was fucking bizarre. That, that was it, they called it like the dark universe. Yeah, really it was wish. like it was like the monster. Yeah, I, I, I really wish that like, without did well and took sound. <laughs> that was nuts. That trailer without the sound, unfortunate. Um, so much potential. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> like, ah, ah, ah. Um, but like, there was a cool scene. Was it Russell Crowe, Dr. Jekyll, Mr. Hyde? Yeah. 
man. Well, like I said, it was it was they they did like a, you know they wanted to do like an MCU, yeah. but they were like dark universe. Instead of building so it through several movies, they went, "What if we don't even finish the first movie?" <laughs> and they start throwing all this shit at you. Like, what if the mummy in the mummy is like a quarter of the film? <laughs> They killed That's the mummy what they did. in Act she, One. She, there's so much of the film where you're like, where is that mummy at? Remember that? Remember the mummy from the first 20 minutes of the film? She's just <laughs> off, like, I don't know, she's probably shopping or something. And there's like the Invisible Man and Dr. Jekyll. It's like all kinds of shit. I really, I used to really like the original mummy movie. I mean, it, dude, yeah, it was, kid, dude, it was yeah. cool. Dude, there was maybe, I don't know, maybe it was six months Monster ago. versus Godzilla. Um, it. I don't know if it still is, but it was on Netflix. The first two were on, I said the first three were on Netflix. Um, and I was just like scrolling through Netflix at night in bed, like, you know, before going to sleep. And I was just like, said to Lindsay, like, Yo, you want to watch The Mummy? It's like, I haven't seen this thing forever. Like, I'll just put it on. I'm like, okay, put it on. And like, I probably fell asleep 20 minutes in because we were going to sleep. We watched The Mummy like nine nights in a row. We never finished it. So it's like every fucking night. I'm like, yo, you want to put The Mummy back on? I'm like, yeah, let's watch The Mummy. And so it's like, I saw certain scenes of The Mummy like five, six, seven times. And it's like, it didn't bore me. I'm just like, oh shit, this is the scene that I saw the last four nights in a row. <laughs> there goes the scare. The CGI does not hold up. No? It's just oh, like, I bet. Yeah, it looks it's pretty so bad. atrocious. Because all the scarabs, are, there's so much CGI. Yeah. It's, it's, it looks bizarre. But like, I used to think it was so it's gross. not a bad movie, man. It's, it is what it is. It's got some good people in it. Yeah. I used to think that that scene with the scarab goes under like his skin and shit. Oh, yeah. and I was like, oh, it's fucking disgusting. Oh, Jalili? Yeah. Yeah. That's oh, still disgusting. Look at it now. That guy's a well, comedian. Oh, yeah, it's bad. It's pretty bad. He's a British comedian, that oh. dude. Well. Yeah, I damn. It's all good. Oh, man. you know. All these fucking Died. stunts. That stunt junkie. <laughs> He's stunting, man. That's just what he wants to do. He just wants to while out. Um, cool stunting, you know? I do what he do. I think it's a show that you oh, and shit. Jeff are talking about. The Society on yeah. Netflix. Mm -hmm. Started watching it five episodes in. Yeah. It's, it. uh, it's not bad. I'm intrigued. Let me. It's uh, got a good. Uh, well, I don't want to say good because you know it hasn't been resolved. But there's an interesting like mystery yeah. involved in it. Do, do we know? find like I'm like I said five episodes in the second half of season one. It's greenlit for season two next year. Yeah. Um. Do we learn more about it? About season two? No, it's more about just year. like the mystery. Uh. Well, it's the aliens. Okay. Cool. Oh, Matt, come a on, little. Son. They they really don't do much about that until like the very end. <laughs> That's what I thought. They start dabbling when back you into it. It's a lot of it. like, how are we gonna do all this? Well, because it makes sense, right? Gonna, the yeah. the plot of the show is like, there's this crazy mystery. This thing happens. There's a smell. But there's a smell, <laughs> which is just really funny. It's just I mean, really it's funny. It's funnier than it should be because it just I just think of poop, right? That's yeah. all I think of is just poop. Like someone pooped. It sounds like where's that smell? Weird smell. A million we'll go million away. and a half dollars to get rid of that smell. <laughs> it's a lot of money. Um, look at the but fuck. like, but like, so then this crazy mystery happens. But then the mystery gets put on hold because they're just like, we need to stay alive yeah. and sort this shit out. So it just becomes this like. Bunch of high school kids. It just kids. becomes a show of like, okay, people surviving in a situation they've been thrust into. And that's most of the show of like, how do we, you know, the society, how do we form, form a society under these new, this, this new environment, you know, this new life that we have now. But then like, as that starts, I don't even say getting smoothed out because there's always drama and shit going mm -hmm. on. But as it becomes established, then it's like, so anyway, about this mystery, right? Yeah. Like, well, like now that we got this shit kind of together here, that's what's. I'm hoping there's a lot. Mom. I'm hoping there's a lot more of it in season two. Me too. But well, it's pretty good. They're good it. actors, and I kind of like that. I don't know anyone from the cast. No. The only person I know from the show <laughs> is Pikachu girl. <laughs> Oh, that is, that's right. Yeah, I just, I call her Pikachu. Yeah, she wasn't Detective Pikachu. Yeah, she was the reporter. Oh, that's oh really? Was from. Yeah, she was. So, that's the only person I Carter recognize. Psyduck. That's from this year. Shit. Hi. Her side that loves, uh, Wasn't that the girl from that things? cock movie? Cock blockers or something? What? Cock dick. I, I oh, is that what John's? The one, the one with the yeah. parents? Yeah, yeah. The one with the cock parents. blockers. <laughs> what was it called? I think it was cock blockers. Okay. It, it, it might have. No, that wasn't it. Huh? Blockers. Blockers. Just blockers. Yeah, there was this, yeah. there was this <laughs> implication was there. It was yeah, not called They would imply the cock, but they wouldn't. Yes, I didn't, I didn't see the movie. I didn't see the movie, but she was in that. All of us were throwing cock in. We're like, it was definitely well, cock mean, something. We knew it was no, there. cock is not in the <laughs> I mean, I knew it was that blockers, was, but you were so sure about the cock, so I was like, <laughs> Yeah, the cock blockers. It's a very confident cock I was like, wait a minute, wait a minute. 
That was that Kepler was always Newton. that always disappointed me that um that one Ratchet and Clank, Ratchet and Clank a crack in time. I think mm. it was either I think that was the second one for PS4, PS3, maybe it's PS3. I want, it I want to say that might be either the first or second one for PS3. Because I, I think the first one was just called Ratchet and Clank. They did the whole like it's kind of like <laughs> a it wasn't a reboot, I, but they were like, it's a new on the console, so there's, there's no subtitle. I swear they gave uh, I might be wrong. I don't know. I only play a, a little bit of that what? series. Gabe? Whatever. Regardless, yeah, it, it was called it was called like Gabriel? a crack in time, but the original Gabe. title was like Gabe. Was like clock stoppers. Oh and yeah. They, they had to change the name because it was like it was like cock blockers. Why don't they just call it stoppers? Dude, clock stoppers yeah, was should. a movie yeah. that Nick Clock stoppers made. was I a movie. Saw that. With yeah, the watch, right, he gets stop old, time and he like yeah. ages while time is stopped. Hell and stuff. yeah. It was hyper time or whatever. Click, click, and click. then when he used hyper time in hyper time, it was like. He could go phase through shit. That's just Ant Man. Ain't got nothing. Well, on I, I'm, watch. that death was your fault. Yeah, that's a good time. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, movies like that. Yeah, it was a Phallus goofy movie. Phallus <laughs> Dude, was goofy so movie was a thing. Remember like Snow Day? That Snow was the thing Day. With, like Josh Peck. Yes. And... The, no, the game was actually going to be called Clock Blockers. <laughs> <laughs> and, they're, and then they're like, this is just too far. That's this on the nose, much. isn't it? It's yeah. a little much. I can see that. It's a little bit on the clock tip there. Clock. It's fucking funny. Those games are fun. What would you do if you could stop time right now? Boop. And not be Sleep. here. No. I would if I could stop fucking time right now. You don't have to be here now. I would, yeah. I would practice this level he, for an eternity. Yeah. Here's oh, the thing. Yeah. Oh, but but you first, stop yeah, time. You realize yeah. stopping time would make this longer. No, I know, but it would be shorter. I'd be able to actually it, enjoy the. the it, how would it be shorter guys. though? But time but would, would be, cease to. It exist. would be longer for me, but I could stop this. It's just crazy because, like, with time being a thing. There is an end to this. You can't conceivably play this forever if you don't beat well, it. I mean, if you stop time, you've I got nothing. You're like shit. Well, Dude, if I, I, I stop time, you maybe. gotta look at the science of it too. Like, does, no, do, do, no do, do I do I stop age? and you're the only thing moving? Oh, like, sucks. who's to say that you stop time and the console still actually? Well, I would, that go, is I would go touch. <laughs> I would go touch all the stuff so it, it yeah. stopped with me. Well, it's the it, well, it he could just take it off the dock though, and he'd be holding the switch. But like, does your digestion stop? Like if I need a poo, I would assume time you stop. as a whole. But the thing is, that any anything else that's not you. So the moment I do a poo, it just hangs in the air. Yeah. Oh yeah. Like what if that? It's just, oh, it you know what's weird? What if like only you and your body stops in, ter in terms of time, but like things like your clothing. Doesn't so, move. So you would just oh, that would be walk a pain. through your right? clothes. Like, I, you, like I would stop time and your clothes would explode because you just went through them <laughs> yeah, at the speed of like, light. Yeah, you're like, well, damn it. Right? Like, <laughs> what is this even for? <laughs> yeah, who's to say your clothes move with you? Yeah, everywhere you walked, you would just tear giant vacuums in <laughs> yeah. space. And like when, when you leave, you everything would be like, like <laughs> high velocity. <laughs> they would explode back in. Somebody in the chat mentioned Asking Pikachu the is questions. also in Big Little Lies. <clears throat> On HBO, she's the she's uh, Reese Witherspoon's daughter. Oh, yeah, I've seen like I haven't watched season. Two I'm yet. on and off watching that show because Jackie watches it while I play mobile games. Okay. Matt yeah. just okay. biffed it. I've, I've, uh, he seemed quite upset with himself. I'm 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 feeling yeah, the arms went in the air and everything. Oh man, that was stupid to me. People are saying it's amazing how much you've improved since the beginning of the stream. That's well, the thing. It's the rhythm. He's back in the rhythm of it. Are you, you in know? the tipsy rhythm zone? Rhythm of, like, of the night. I'm in the zone. Uh, dude, I'm going to be honest with you, Gavin. This is just uh, uh. me not even knowing what I'm doing anymore. Like I said in the stream, it was like, I quit actually looking at the screen, and mostly just it's all muscle memory. That's how it goes, man. Oh, it. It's Matt's flexing his muscles. It's the thing. Yeah, but that's muscles. why I'm dying. It's like yeah, speed, it is like I watch uh, stuff. I watch Tony play TDR sometimes, and she's on expert. All the shit's coming down, mm -hmm. and I'm like, "How are you seeing that fast?" And she's like, "I'm not even looking. I'm yeah, just like, yeah. I can kind of feel it. <laughs> I can feel all the arrows, and then I just do it. And I'm like, I'm not looking at each arrow. Though. I'm like, what does that mean? Have you memorized it? She's like, No, I'm just sort of like, <laughs> I don't know what you're talking yeah. about. I don't know how you do that. It's like your peripheral actually does all the work. Peripheral. Shit, peripheral. Yeah, I was gonna say it, but you you got it. Yeah, you, so, you got him. You, know, you got him real good. Take that. I dare you. Pikachu oh, girl is oh, also oh, supernatural. Get back to the game. Yeah. What season is supernatural in like 40. seventeen? It's like <laughs> fucking yeah. It's, it's the latest it's one. Their like final one though, right? Didn't they announce years, that? Super cock natural. <laughs> <laughs> oh, like that that movie cock sucker. <laughs> <laughs> Dick suckers was a great movie. <laughs> <laughs> I feel like it's been so long since I've progress. Okay. It's a good run. It's a good run here. There you go, Matt. Here it is. Matt is here on a solid is. run. He's this. going back to Look the left. Look at that. You're making moves. He's going right. Now he's jumping. 
Oh, over Dude, the fire in the place. And, like, again, and he's back. Fire's come. He, Fucker! He walks into that one a lot. And I get it, though, because he's got to go immediately after that fire yeah. comes down. Yeah. But, like, he was having a lot of trouble earlier today with that pipe. He's just clearing it now. Yeah. He kept, you didn't have the momentum, so he wasn't jumping high enough. Matt clearing pipe. Yeah, dude. dude. He's laying it. He's clearing it. Matt clear. <laughs> Did you say who the sponsors were? Mm -hmm. Yeah. What are they? They are Blue Apron, Movement, uh, and Casper. I must have been watching Matt when he did that. Yeah. yeah, I got through it. Season we we season came season. in hot with, you know, Matt playing the game. And I did that. I'm not even doing an ad read soon. Ugh. I begged Matt to not beat it during an ad read. And he was like, he's <laughs> like, I'm just going to stop playing. Yeah. <laughs> I'm just going to pause. Because I was like, you be quiet if you beat it. I'm not you worried about that. You want to be setting no records. I'm not worried about it either. Yeah. But. <clears throat> Do I want to watch The Lion King? I that's, I'm I'm there too. Where I'm like, live I don't action know, maybe. Disney movies. Uh, uh. But see that's Al that's the Aladdin? least live action. I have not seen Aladdin yet. No. Sorry. Yeah, I heard it wasn't bad. It's okay. I mean, I I liked it because I remember the original songs yeah. and that, and it's cool to see them all big and kind of like with X Men. I was like, oh, my cartoons are with real well, people now, but. Wasn't it didn't add it wasn't, anything. It wasn't, it wasn't terrible, is what you're saying. It wasn't a piece of shit. Any okay. of, I thought Will have, Smith was good. Have any of those Disney movies, the live action versions, any of them added anything? Because uh, even the ones that Maleficent, are okay right? are like, uh, that's okay. I haven't watched Maleficent. Maleficent like, apparently is good and has like a nice big backstory. I saw Beauty and the Beast and I was just like, <laughs> it's, I mean, at best, you got the shots. I would from say the animated some. Yeah. Some moments Why were grander than the um, original. Okay. The like Jungle Prince Book. Ali song. Yeah. Shitloads of people all over the screen. Shit flying everywhere. Damn. Thought it was amazing. Okay. But in the in the cartoon, it's like there's some people there. So I, see, I didn't get that ever there's from Beauty and the Beast. Uh, no point in the film was I like, whoa. Oh. It's also, <laughs> I mean, worth the remake. It's also. Uh, oh, Matt was freaking out over there. I'm, I'm um, it's also a movie where all the furniture is alive. <laughs> So it's yeah. true. It's a little yeah, harder true. to completely believe that in live action than it is in a fucking cartoon. Uh, and then I thought Beast just looked like shit. So it just bothered me the whole movie. <laughs> no, I agree with that. Just like the put a fucking like suit on a guy for fuck's sake. Why does he have to be CGI? He's a goddamn man. He's a humanoid man. Put some fucking makeup on him. But then he it would have just been like cats. He it wears just been a dummy. Man that's why I said you know really did yeah. nail it. It would have been like cats. a tiny headed Dude, thing on a giant body. Dude, you spending fucking $200 I mean, million dollars on CGI. You can get practical effects. It's true. Okay? What is that Come movie on. where Tim Curry is the cats. devil? <laughs> <laughs> but he has the most elaborate prosthetic. He looks like oh, such um, a like fucking 80s He's movies have it. It's amazing Labyrinth, that. for fuck's sake. Like, come on. Yeah. You can do it. Do it. And be like, again, what like, I can see is that not, Beast is, is like, the dude's wearing a cock coat. Devil? Or is it's cock devil. Oh. <laughs> it's cock devil. The devil the wears caca. <laughs> Black, uh, dog, cock. What is that called? What's that called? <laughs> dark, oh, cock. you got shit on him. You're losing it. But I'm just oh, like, dude, dude, are, 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 are furries, I mean, like, it, losing their mind about cats? Uh, you are. Yeah. No, I mean, like... I'm, you're losing your mind for furries. You just keep talking about I'm this. I'm just gonna I've think, like, just been like just furries are gonna go nuts. Furries right? gonna, I'm not, but furries are gonna go nuts for this movie. I just gotta, you know, support the people who like things. You don't have to. What's the... Everyone's saying legend. Legend, yeah. yeah legend. Legend. Not, legend. Not dark black cock. Cock legend. Cock <laughs> legend. <laughs> Was, like, the first cat's really, like, not weird... Like when you look at look back at, like well, yeah. no, I mean it was, it was pretty, pretty weird. Yeah, about the, 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 the oh, musical, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. yeah I mean, it was pretty weird. I mean, I watched it one weekend well, at uh, make, a buddy's house, and yeah, his parents were making us do it. Uh, you know, but shape like, of water. She fucked the fish. The thing about that though is again, when you picture into the movie, you got it right. Like I feel like, and and it's just black cock down. <laughs> Tenacious D and the cock of destiny. <laughs> Dude, when you're behind enemy lines, get in the enemy's behind. <laughs> That's the tagline right there. Um, I'm proud of that one. Um, the thing about too, like when you go to like a Broadway show, they're all fucking weird, right? Like there's a well, different yeah. standard for film. I haven't seen a lot. Like, so Mamma Mia. I'm just saying you can do something like Cats and people go nuts over it. And then the movie comes out and people are like, what the fuck is this? Yeah. Like, and like, they should yes, just be cats, real cats. Cats was fucking weird. Yes. And like, you can have, a, I feel like, a same level of movie going audience that could have seen the original Cats and be like, what the fuck? <laughs> and it's just like, theater's weird as shit, dude. And like, Broadway's fucking weird. And it's just like, 
It's just a different world. <laughs> Grinding <Yeah>. Nemo. <laughs> what did he start? Shitter. I don't know. That was just really funny. Grinding Nemo. Well, could be a good remake. Sorry. That could be cool. There's mostly people. There's a dragon involved, but beyond that, we haven't seen the dragon yet. Is it yet. still going to be it's Eddie? Show us people. Disney. You fucking it's cowards. It's just Eddie Murphy in a suit. <laughs> <laughs> like he's the voice and well, like, in a tux. <laughs> Yo, I'm yeah. here. I need a paycheck. <laughs> What's up, Mushu? Yo, what up? I'll play the other characters too. Okay, I'll play Mulan as well. Why not? I'm really good at that. I do all. Yo, I just want to see her climb that pole, get that arrow. Mallcock, <laughs> Robocock. I think Jimmy Wong is in that movie. Yeah. In what? Oh, Robocock. Oh. Can we make a movie? <laughs> no, can we make a movie Robocop. version of this level? This was, yeah. Uh. Can we make a movie of this level that's just fucking going back and forth for forever? Yeah, Matt, you're making the movie right now. Oh what do you God. think you're doing? So How long do you this is a four hour movie? <laughs> you already spent two hours Dude. on it before it's the podcast. Be longer than the director's cut of Watchmen. It will. The, the special features it's are. It's gonna, gonna be, be really called awesome. Watchmat. Watchmat with a <laughs> special animated segment spread across. Yeah. We gotta get me to Mars so I can show off my dick. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's that's the reveal when they pan down and Matt's cocks out of the table. It's like, why wouldn't it be though? Why yeah, wouldn't no it? No one was up, judging up the stool. He's playing oh, Mario. Why does it even matter? Oh, I'm feeling the alcohol more now. Uh oh, Milan isn't going to be a remake. It's a readaption of the story. I don't know what that means. What does remake mean? That's the same thing. Re no readaption. What? What's the difference? I don't know. We're making shit up now. <laughs> Disney's always making shit up, dude. <laughs> Fuck. They take a. Re they take like a, an existing story <laughs> and then they and then they spin it. <laughs> Top cock. <laughs> Top card Such an easy, uh, easy bunch of jokes coming in. Some of the, some of them are not good. J no, jokes. You're I mean, right in line by calling them jokes. Someone wrote cock dependence day. <laughs> and, but then you said, and then you brought attention to it. Yeah. You pointed some it out than and others. talking about it. Yeah, you set right. them off now. It's a good, uh, it's a good run. Well, now it has to be, doesn't chat. it? I feel like we're watching one in 30 runs that you make. If that, it's a good thing you're watching the good one too, because I normally don't make it past your shit. Dude, there's just oh, oh you just bonked your head. So you can't be bonking your head on that block, or else flames. you get burned up. You get burned up, dude. I, I do want to really quick. I saw some people say they were gonna take a shot every time I died. Rip, because you're yes, dead. You you're die. already dead. You will die before that. Maybe like a sip. Take of like a shot. a shot of air. Or yeah. <laughs> Breathe. Have a pipette. If you if you hold your breath until Matt dies, you'll breathe fine. Yeah. I'll just say that. Just breathe when he dies. <gasps> you'll, you'll get Should we all try it on the next run? Yes. Okay, okay he just okay, died. After that. <gasps> yeah, give me a second. We're respawning. And there breathe. <laughs> very very doable. Very doable. Very doable. That was pretty uh, straightforward. <laughs> Like, you, can you hold your breath for 10 seconds? All right, cool. I was really hoping I could get further than that. Oh, fuck. What if Matt... Stop! Stop reading them! Stop saying it! Coxter's Inc. <laughs> Coxter's Inc's funny. Cox Please stop. There you all right, go. Eric, chill out. Oh, uh, fake Eric. I mean, it's that was, Eric. That was him, it's really him. It's really Please him, but he's stop. not here right now. To be right fair, now. like this is probably more real Eric than the human Eric, because this one's here all the time. <laughs> what do you think he's doing? <laughs> oh, <laughs> he's doing absolutely nothing. There's nothing, right? I was saying this earlier. Like, like he's probably just hanging out with the Mega Sixty Four guys, and I was like, what if Eric working here is just a bit? And like two years from now, he's gonna put out a video where like he pretended to move here, yeah. but he had to move here for. It seems if anyone's gonna do it, Mega Sixty Four would do it. <laughs> He's yeah, just filming. Baby. He just shot the fuck up. <laughs> Why is that on the board? What what situation yeah, is that baby. for? <laughs> Fucker. Yeah, they were going to all the trouble of you know, getting him on salary, getting benefits, all this extra. Rooster stuff. Rooster doesn't know. He just conned them all. Yeah. And then there's just going to be some. And then and then knowing Mega Sixty Four, it's going to be an eighty second video that they're going to yeah. put out. It's going to be two years of footage, and it's just going to come out in one of their game days videos. Yeah. And then it'll just be back in San Diego. <laughs> I can't wait for it to be like, yeah, we're sharing the benefits the whole time. <laughs> we're all Eric. That probably helps, though. He probably, like, they're like, man, Eric, you get sick a lot in San Diego for some reason. And write the name Garrett on your, <laughs> on your patient information. Oh, uh, you burned your butt. Yeah. Matt had a butt booty. Uh, Matt. Yeah, that's a good burn. Matt, why don't you take a second? Why don't you take a break? Okay. You know? If you want, you know, you had some barbecue earlier, you can take a nap. Let me tell you about Casper Mattress. 
This episode of Bob Topic is brought to you by Casper. We've been talking about Casper for a while now, and that's because they're great. Casper is a sleep brand that continues to revolutionize your sleep experience one night at a time with great new products. What is it that you always look for in a mattress? Sink and bounce, right? The original Casper mattress combines multiple supportive memory foams for a quality sleep surface with just the right sink and just the right bounce. Casper now offers four other mattresses, the Wave, the Essential, the Hybrid Casper, and the Hybrid Wave. The hybrid mattresses combine the pressure relief of the award-winning foam with durable yet gentle springs. Buying the right Casper is easy. Order online. It's delivered to your door in a compact box, and you get free shipping and free returns to the U.S. and Canada. I've had a Casper for several years at my house. It's super comfy. People always compliment it when they come and stay. It's uh, one of the best mattresses I've ever owned, for sure. Considering we spend one-third of our lives on a mattress, hopefully, if you're getting some sleep. You should, it's important. It's so important to truly sleep on a mattress before committing, that's why Casper gives you 100 nights to try it out. It's over three months. Get $50 towards select mattresses by visiting casper.com slash off topic and using promo code off topic at checkout. Terms and conditions apply. That's $50 towards select mattresses by visiting casper.com slash off topic and using promo code off topic at checkout. Oh, Casper mattress. Sorry, Matt, your nap's over. Okay, he's studying now. He's studying the level. Over, so have the you? Game footage. Um, the ending of this is so it's stupid and dumb. Have you made it further than before we started? I have. Okay, but only so, once. Okay, but you've done it. Yeah. Oh, what's God. what? Have you noticed what time you were at? I didn't even look. Okay. I don't. Because you were down to such a twenty-three. I think it was. Is where you made it. Uh, <laughs> Before the podcast, that's inside of me right now. Yeah, it's that's, such a fierce smell. It's also like Matt's a fierce guy, who I'm like he, he doesn't drink that much. He doesn't have a very high tolerance <laughs> and refuses to drink beer. Yeah. Have you ever yeah. just had straight scotch? He just drinks that. No, I'm not a man's man like that. Yeah, it's my. They just like, do the whole like. Big I don't get that. Ice. Yeah, and, and some people like it. I mean, it looks yeah. cool like, as shit. I do straight you anything. Feel bad it's in ass. shots and like. <sighs> to me, that's the last acquired taste. Like you just gain taste as you get older. Like stuff that sucked as a kid is like, oh, I'm okay with it. That, beer. I, just, I haven't gone to it yet. I like I'm not, beer. I'm not doing I like, like an achievement list for tastes. I didn't. I didn't start drinking beer and go delicious. I can like, get it, it down now. Really. I can do it with ice, but there was a time where I was probably 20 with Jeff, and Jeff was just like. <laughs> And I just had a sip, and I was like, <laughs> it took me like an hour and a half to half my drink. And then he just had the rest. I feel like I'm still basically there with most liquor. Yeah. That's I just, it's just, I can't drink Give it and just be like, drinks. delicious. Tastes yeah, good. I'm all for it. I like <laughs> anything with pineapple. <laughs> Pineapple's fucking oh, delicious, dude. I love the pineapple. fruitier, the better. Yeah. The only problem with those is like, you get headaches. Oh, yeah. I do anyway. I get yeah, headaches right. and tummy aches because I'm an old piece of shit the now. The sugary sugar dehydration. Yeah. Dude, I got a real headache from Let's Roll the other day. I don't know why. I was just drinking tea. All right, I'm not going to read anymore, but they're still going nuts in the chat. Oh, yeah, they've got... Oh, dude, okay, honey, I shrunk the cock. I, you <laughs> <laughs> okay. well, Matt, stop looking at the sorry, chat. I'm sorry. No, Play dude, the you have a game. job right now, Well, I, dude, I've, I've, I got it down. I can look at both. No, you can't. You're right. You cannot. <laughs> Based on that death. Correct. Some of them, I don't even know what they are. It's like Cock of the Cocks. It's like, what movie was that? Which one? That could be oh, anyway. I have no idea. Man, I'm She's surprised. Cock. <laughs> Stop. I'm surprised nobody made like cock and run. I mean, oh, like chicken, chicken run, chicken run. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking, that's like the one appropriate use of it. Yeah. Okay. Uh, okay. Chicken. Chicken. I'm just so distracted by chicken. Anybody uh, playing anything? Mario Maker. Besides Mario Maker and what Matt's doing physically I am right now. Go back, because I knew it would happen. The moment Red Dead came out, I put down Assassin's Creed. Odyssey? Odyssey? Origins? Oh, no, Odyssey. Odyssey. Odyssey's the newer one. And I'm gonna go back to it. I never Dude, DLC for that's awesome. I never that started game it. good. is incredible. It's I love it. Good game. I've, I'm 30 minutes in. I yeah, I'm gonna have to. It's that's when you start and you're, you're like fighting. Hey, was it a good like 30 minutes though? battle, right? Yeah, yeah, I think I did like two missions. I, uh, or is that I was so distracted with those games. It's, no, that's it's, not it's that's not Origins. Yeah. I've played over 200 hours of that game and I'm still loving it. It's a I, great game. It took me a little while to get into it, so I assume it's going to take me a couple of goes to get Shit. back into it. Mm. But I was enjoying it. I was God. sad to put it down. I still yeah. have to go back to Red Dead. I'm excited to do uh, Marvel Ultimate Alliance 3 comes out today. So oh, yeah. I'm excited to just, like, play kind of like a you know an arcade brawler game with, like, three others. It's and... just a beat-em-up. Yeah. <laughs> 
It's just mindless. It'll be fun as hell for a week, and I'll never touch it again. Well, but then, sometimes doing, you need that, you know? I'm doing, oh, I totally um, do. I need to take a break. I need to rest my hands. That's a uh, tell me how, looking how's at your hands these days. Dude, it's kind of worse. That's I do I do like my daily stretches and stuff, hands. but like I can feel like tension sometimes and it's locked up a couple times, but that is, is it is. is it in your hands or is it like in your arm? It's what well, it is fucking I tend tendonitis right it here, is. so <laughs> sometimes it just feels like sometimes I like grab like a grocery bag and I can it's just like a tight you just tension go, that uh, you carry these. Yeah. Um but then my wrist I could feel it after like a lot of gameplay. Shit, man. Yeah. <laughs> Got me to where I was today, so I'll do it again if I have to. <laughs> you get by. Just not as well. Yeah. Yeah. You just want to do it as well. No, no, no. no. <laughs> That's like I was I was feeling something like in my, my arm right here after playing Mario Maker for a while. Then you realize to, dude, it's his arm. It could be it. It's I'm not gonna lie. If you guys are on your phone a lot, if you're playing a lot of games, just take fucking ten minutes every day to like do like arm, like wrist stretches. So, so what is like, it? Is it just push the push it in, push it out? It's the it's the, the lack of rest. It's like the just lactic the acid muscles. of some sort. What what causes? Is it Shit. what about the continued gaming causes it to happen faster? I think it's just like the tension that you put. On your hands. See, that's so weird to me that that could be a permanent condition. That you that's get. why I hate fucking mouse and keyboard shit because, like, I it never feels comfortable. Oh, it's well, the controller can do it too. It's yeah. Well, I feel controller. like if the controller does it, it's it's more subtle. I feel it like, like it's happening way. as I touch yeah. the keyboard. Where I'm like, ah, yeah. like my hand is in a state of ah as I'm playing. Whereas the controller, it's probably just going, I'm fucking killing. <laughs> like I'm just like, it's comfy while I do it though. I, I know there's like one time I noticed that, and I was like, Need for Speed Underground Two. I played that game very specific day in day out, and like my <laughs> hand, my index finger got tired from like driving with the gas, and I was like, it, it just it hurt. I don't know. I've yeah. got the uh, I put I pushed it down too far. Stretch your wrists. I just well, got the index. Is it Valve Index or Steam Index? The VR thing? Oh, it's yeah, like you the, were talking about The one about that's it. not the Vive, no it's the new one. But anyway, it like tracks your fingers. Like you just strap your hand to the pole, and then you can do. You don't have to touch it. You can just like do fingery stuff. Oh. And it tracks it all. And I feel like it's the best controller ever. Like it doesn't it's even feel like hands. you're holding something some of the time. Yeah, it's Obviously, just your... for like Beat Saber, you just grab it for other so stuff. So then you can if use it's the like buttons. a gun game, do you just like. like is it still has a trigger. Out? Like, you can still treat it just like any other controller. Gabby, yeah, you can't be doing that. <laughs> Damn it! <I'm> sorry! <laughs> Interesting. Uh, dude, I did VR for the first time not too long ago. You, you fell know. out of it. I, I was, dude, I was dripping in sweat. <laughs> like, it was real fear. It's one of those things where, like, with horror, like, horror games, I, do, I let myself get fully immersed in it. Yeah. And I then I get that. really fucking terrified. I couldn't. And so I was, I was scared. I, I couldn't was like, no bullshit. A... That's me afraid. Yeah, <laughs> I could for the be world to see yeah. Resident Evil Four for so long because of that. Like the the fucking part with the island with the regenerators. Yeah, the fucking weird. Of big nope. <laughs> yeah, they make like 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 clicky cookie mm -hmm. like, yeah. sounds. That's like like when, I, when I was much younger, I'm like, I, I, nope, not even if I was paid a Those billion dollars. Those dudes too of there. like all the enemies in the game, I feel like pop out the most. Yeah, and they have very like like. There's like one spot. No you can kill. bone structure movements. Mm -hmm. I don't know how to describe it. They're like fucking uh like they'll just be like they're always like bent over, like lying because you, you get to them too when you're in that fucking trash part. They're like all in the trash and shit, and they're just like Yep. And they're bitches too. Like, cause most enemies, if they pop up, you just blast them in the head and they'll buy you time. But those dudes don't, because you gotta hit their little Exactly. The little weak spots. They also can like stretch their arms out. And yeah, they do a little they go a little from gooey. And turn it away. It was it was horrifying as a kid. Now after I've uh, become an adult and have unlimited ammo because I still have the same save file, they're easy. Easy peasy. Damn. Are you so are you Shit. when you play the game, do you Play an old save file with limited ammo. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> play this game in three years, unlimited ammo. All right. I don't care. Maybe you I already, go already the story. I, I put in the work already. <laughs> I hate it when I pick up a game that I feel like I put down a few months earlier, but the save file is from like three or four years before, and you're just like, where did the time go? Yeah, mm. it's always depressing. Terrifying. Dude, Mike, that's, you're that's playing like Mario Kart 8. How are you doing that? That's like achievements, man. Yeah. It's super interesting and depressing at the same time, where I'm just like. Oh, I got an achievement seven months ago? Fuck. Yeah. I thought that was a month. I thought that was two months. Or then it's just like four years. Okay. And, and it's this and with me and like Master Chief Collection, it's a game where I picked it up for like three months at a time over the course of four years. And I just think like a few months have gone by, it's like, ah, oh, 2016 was my last yeah. achievement. 2016 used to be new. <laughs> yeah, I was like, 
all the stuff that's happened since 2016. Yeah, you get very <laughs> sucked too. Where like I'll have shit like that. Where you know, even even say 2015. It's not forever ago. It's not the 90s. You know what I mean? It's what HBO. But it'll be like out. apparently. <laughs> uh, but I'll be like. You know, thinking of my life now and how it's been, you know, for a period of time, for quite some time, I'll just be like, oh shit, like Lindsay and I were married for three months, you know? Or yeah. like, I had no kids then. You know? Yeah, I'll, I'll Kids are a huge game changer, where it's like, yeah. two years doesn't seem that long ago, and then I'm like, fuck, two years, like, Iris was, like, not born yet. I mean, she was now, but like, you know. Yeah, I don't, thinking, I don't remember like, the, oh, shit, the game, but... I was like, man, I lived in a different house. I had no cats, and Ray worked with us. <laughs> that was the last <laughs> time I played. I was like, oh, all the stuff has happened. It's it's Damn also it. interesting too, because like here has been like, yeah, we do different <laughs> shit too, like you know, like Haunter no, it's, and. It's funny you have like a mark for every time you play. <laughs> yeah, the he does. Now. He's moving them around. Um, you know, even like the shows that we do. You know, you can like you know when we. We did Hardcore Tabletop. That wasn't a show, and then it was, you know? And then we did Haunter, like, you know, even off topic. Like, the show's coming up on four years. Like, we're, I think this is episode, like, 190 or 191 or something. Like, it's almost 200 episodes. Damn. And I just think of, like, fuck, like, I remember when off topic was new for a long time. And even now, I don't think of it as old. I just think, oh, yeah, we've been doing it a while. I don't think four fucking years. You know what I mean? Like, we've been doing holy it for shit. four years. Yeah. Shit, dude. Yeah, dude. I I still remember uh, you guys recording the pilot. Two hundred. Yeah. yeah. And f- and half the episode was me talking about mountain monsters. Season six coming out yeah. next month. By the way, move to the travel channel. <laughs> uh, August twenty first, twenty third, something like that. Um, it's just crazy how, but like, but like, still. Even though there's new shit we do at work, it's still like the basics are there. It's still like we've been in this building the longest we've ever been in one spot, like Achievement Hunter. You know, like I think in its existence period, even before I got there, like I don't think we as a as like a department have ever been in one space longer than where we are now. So it's just like yeah, and it's still the new room in my head. Right, the new yeah. room is the <laughs> longest room, like you know, the room we've been in the longest. Um, but like, there's so much. Uh, like normalcy there of like, eh, moon balls and this and that or whatever. But like outside of work is like fucking it's different every month. Where I'm just like, holy yeah. shit, I got a kid. I got two fucking kids now, you know? I I'm, noticed I'm that all this shit around my house. Yesterday we did an Awu and we were just trying to find out what the shortest Awu was. Some which is apparently really two minutes. Short ones, yeah. But I was yeah. scrolling through for like what felt like five minutes. I was scrolling through, I was looking at the time codes until we got to the other office. Oh. Because we've been in there for like hundreds of episodes in our current The office. last one or two sure. offices ago? The one that was just there. Okay. I, the one in the no. I made it but didn't. Room. Hey, oh, hey. Matt died. Yeah. He's upset. No, um, I remember, this is going to be the dumbest memory, but I remember you, Michael, and uh, Lindsay being on in Loco Cycle. Like, mm-hmm. a long fucking time ago. Mm-hmm. And I was like, I just got my Xbox One. I'm like, oh, fuck yeah, this is that's awesome. Those are people I know from a different thing. Sitting there, and now I'm like here doing all this shit. I'm like, that's crazy. Time moving that quickly. Time flies, man. It, it yeah, feels I like yesterday. Doing that, dude. Then Somebody just tweeted me about that like within <laughs> yeah, exactly. the last week. And they're like, you're in fucking local cycle. I was like, that was 40 years ago. <laughs> yeah, I, I know. It's like that's so long ago, but it that doesn't was, feel like that. That was literally like, and then, again, this is even the times. Like that was like an open invitation to Rooster Teeth, like the company. Like, hey, we're doing this um, live action intro. For a video game coming out, it was in Austin, and they're like, if anybody from Rooster Teeth wants to come by and be in it, like, it's just tons of extras and shit, just wear, like, um, it's just like a fancy party, so just wear, like, a, a dress or a suit or some shit like that, shit. and you could just come do it. Because there was, like, 30 employees at the company. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Like, like now, the company would be more than every extra in the whole <laughs> game, like, in the yeah. shot, you know? There was, like, maybe... A hundred people there, or something like that, and I just remember being like, Lindsay and I had nothing to do. We were just like, hey, "You want to go?" And we just like went after work one day, and it was a couple hours, and they were like, they were just like, uh, "We'll give you free food," and I was like, "Yeah, yeah sure, why not?" Now it would be like. Uh, can you schedule it six months in advance? I'll yeah. fucking hire a nanny. I'll make sure we're in town, blah, blah, blah. Then I was like, I'm just going to go home and play Skyrim so we could go be in this video game instead. And I'm like, okay. <laughs> we're also like six years old yeah. like, in that game. It was so fucking long the ago. Uh, the other day I went back to episode two of Minecraft just to watch T.O.P. When I made the Tower of Pimps for the first time. And uh, there was a comment from like a few months ago. 
He was like, oh, I'm just watching this again. I'm at work. I was in third grade when this came out. Oh my god! Oh, I was like, why? Oh, Jesus. Oh, I'm at work? Damn. So like, what was he like? No! I'm in seventh grade now. That was unique. That's <laughs> the first when time. Look at this. Look at this. Get back to the child minds. <laughs> <laughs> we, we said she was working at 14. I was working at 14, 14? but good luck. No, most play, most, play, most wow. places, child labor laws are a little different when places, your family owns a business. That's true. Most places are 15. Does her but you can family own Taco somewhere. Bell? I don't know. Maybe. Okay. <laughs> I, I don't know her heritage. <laughs> she can do whatever. <laughs> Weird term. A little white. Um. Yeah. I mean, we all know. <laughs> white weems. Uh, <laughs> white weems. <laughs> it's not wrong, dude. I yeah. woke up with a plan today, and that plan. Okay. No, dude, it was it a nice plan. It was a beautiful plan. I woke plan. up and I was like, okay, I know it's literally just us here. We, we, we're going to play Goldeneye. We played Goldeneye. We made that plan yesterday. We mm -hmm. made the plan yesterday. And we're going to come day. in. We're going to do Goldeneye. We're going to do the stream, which Matt is still doing now. Right, dude, we're going to get it done. I played Goldeneye, the Tina Turner hit song. Played yeah, that in the, the office. office. Yeah. You did. And we're going to do off topic. Good. That yeah. was the day. Played the DK rap for a bit. So I was like, <laughs> I had to cut it. But. <laughs> cut it short. Yeah, well, yeah. We, you know, we want Nintendo to come in and break our speakers. So, uh, <laughs> I woke up and I was just like, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna eat breakfast today. I'm gonna get torchies. Haven't gotten, I haven't had torchies in like a month and a half, two months. Like, it's been a while. So I was just like, I'm gonna fucking order tacos. I'll go pick them up. I'll swing by the office. We'll have breakfast. Uh, went to order it. The fucking online ordering was down. I was like, you're oh. kidding me. I gotta go in there and order it in person? Damn, dude, 2019. But you know, this is my this is my cross. You know? <laughs> so that's my burden. Burn the so bear. I, so I parked my car and I walked into Torchies and I ordered tacos and I sat there. And then right after I ordered the tacos, I sat down, I took my phone out, I slacked Sarah. And I, what, I think I said, uh, I slacked her and I said, I'm saying it loud and I'm saying it now. Rudy's for lunch before off topic. Please and thank you. And she was like, I will get it done. And I was like, fucking awesome. We're done. I was, and then uh, I texted you guys and I was like, phase one, I'm getting torchies. Phase two, and then I sent the picture of the conversation. And I said, like, phase three, nap. I was in my kitchen, I was pulling a snap kitchen out of the fridge. I was like, I'll take this to work and... Okay, well, I can't. <laughs> I'm not gonna take that to work. We're doing Rudy's. Yeah, we did it though. Okay. It all worked. We got Everything torches. We out. ate it. Damn we it. did Goldeneye. We did the stream. So good. We got Rudy's. We ate it. We're doing the podcast. Oh. And Matt's still doing this. Also, Matt yeah. kept saying yesterday he was going to get drunk playing Mario, and he's doing Damn. it. He's doing I his did. own phases. You know, I, I still going to get drunk <laughs> phase one on the podcast. Knows. And I'm all the Wake podcast up. and boy, let me tell you. Getting there. Matt's losing it. Fucking shit. Oh, he finished his have drink. Have some more drinks. Yeah, Matt is falling apart. My favorite Matt. All right. All right. Or fucking off. I almost called you Jack because Jack generally tells me I'm falling apart. Damn, no, it's you my wanna... favorite Matt though. Well, okay, if it's your favorite, then I won't. Yeah, I won't tell you to do this Matt. yourself. <laughs> there, I mean, looking back on old games, you always remember them more fondly. They always look better in your head than how they look now. Oh yeah, Goldeneye. Oh, Goldeneye, dude. It, it, I feel like not only does it not hold up, someone came in and like diddled with the cartridge to make it <laughs> shittier. Like, Dude, why are you gonna put it like that? It looks like the blobs, the frame rate, Bro. if everyone's in the same place, was like 4 was FPS. There a, was there a way to turn off inverted? Oh, I don't know. Controls? There probably was, but we just didn't do it. Here's the thing, there's no up and down in that game until you was, stand still and look around wild. when you go. So Dude, it'd be a bunch of people like, <laughs> That's actually probably good trigger discipline. Like, you don't want to aim while you're moving. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> this is, so. I assume, a British thing. We don't use these words here. But uh, Panda Lally, probably fucking it up, says, I was in sixth form when I first started watching Rage Quit Surgeon Simulator. It's the first video they saw. And they just finished university. Yeah. Sixth form is, you know, sixth 17, 18 years form? old. See, I didn't, know what that, I didn't know what that meant, sixth form. It's what you do after. So you can leave school at 16. And if you don't. Leave. You could just do sixth form. Oh, like, like college, Dragon college stage. Like final form. Yeah. And shit. See, if you said sixth form, I would just be yeah. like, oh, sixth grade. Yeah. yeah. But no. No. Different. Not their own rules. Different to year six. They make Weird. their own rules. That's still crazy. Trying to sixth form. Like yeah. you just have different forms of life. <laughs> yeah, dude. Like, what is... Yeah, and then you become. What, what form are you in right now? This thing. Yeah. What are you? Um, Ick form. Stinky form. I guess like. Oh shit. Twelfth form. Twelfth form. 
That would make sense. That's a lot of fucking forms. That's so many forms. Twelve. Maybe like W nine. I couldn't. I couldn't. Dude, don't even get me started on that. Oh. Oh, you're gonna talk about tax shit? I'm not gonna talk about no. it because I hate it. It's so, nothing so. makes my skin crawl more than while I'm doing it. And then also just like navigating shit as I'm filling out forms, oh, knowing yeah. like this is wrong. I know this is, I know I'm fucked here. Yep. But like I'm a fucking, you know, 32 years old and I have to fucking do it. And like, well, and some like, forms are like, this I'm, is a legal document. Like, if you give incorrect dude, statements on this form, right. you've it's, broken the law. It's That's fucking, scary you know, shit. Yeah, That's but, why but you pay someone to do it. You can always plead ignorance. Fortunately, it, it does always specify, even because it knows human beings are fucking stupid. It said if you knowingly provide false information, yeah. I will get to a point where I'll go, oh. Uh, yeah, but if someone right, doesn't, caught, if someone like doesn't pay their taxes because they didn't know they had to, it surely still goes. Yeah, but that's not fair. that's not filling out a form wrong. Yeah, yeah, yeah but be fair, like, well, be fair get out of prison. If they my just... if my dad never told me, I would not have paid taxes ever. What? what? Matt, that's <laughs> hey, I didn't know. Some How do you not know? know? Someone Some know. Know. somewhere would have said wild. the word taxes. The thing yeah. is, like, I as a I, kid. I'm sorry. Do I not pay taxes when I buy something? What's that? Shut the hell that's up. <laughs> it's called sales tax, man. Yeah. That's why it's called sales tax. Um, tax isn't the, the the phrase. That's why, like, the thing, Don't the, the, the biggest thing of like becoming an adult is like when you're a kid, like. Little kid, you know, like yeah. ten, even teenager. There's the like you're old enough and self aware enough to go. That's adult shit. I don't know what the fuck that is, and I don't know when I'll learn it. And then you're there, and you still don't know it, and you're like, oh shit. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. No one taught me. Yeah. yeah I didn't I know. Think back and I was like, you man, my shit out. I was like, oh shit. My dad was doing that when he was 23. I'm 31, and I've never done <laughs> yeah. That and he's like, <laughs> oh, I just assumed yeah. there would be a manual at some point, <laughs> or like, or maybe like a be, class in I'd college. I'd wake up one day and I would know. Shit. I would just be like, oh, no. I would just, I just know this now. You know, like every like Sunday when my dad would go in the dining room and he's got doing like, like what's he doing? It's like, oh, he's doing checkbook stuff, Shh. like. Keeping my records and f writing bills and doing this and that. Like, I am absolutely certain right now, if there wasn't auto pay, I'd be dead somewhere. <laughs> I would just be rotting to death in a gutter or something. I always have like, to check like, up like, on thank that. Thank God for auto pay, man. Like, once That's a year. Like, I check well, up on subscriptions and auto pay. I mean, I, I check up every time my fucking credit card gets canceled, which seems to be every six months, and it's yeah. like the most traumatic event in history. <laughs> but you realize it where I'm just like, oh, fucking great. I got to, first of all, find what I'm paying for. Who the fuck knows? Like, I think I know everything. It's like, oh, all the big ones, like, oh, this Dude. bill and electric bill and, you know, all that shit. But then it's like the late fees pop up. You're like, fuck, I forgot about that. You know, like a month or two months later. But like every time that happens where I got to change up my credit card, I'm sitting there thinking, this is the fucking end of my life. This is so much work. This is fucking crazy. And then I'm just like, oh, people have to do this every week. Yeah. Like, like there was no auto pay. It was just like, yeah. I gotta write this check and put it yeah. in the fucking mail and drive to the post office and fucking mail this somewhere. Imagine writing a check How did to we Netflix make it to now? every month. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, my parents do. God. <laughs> people writing like your parents, check. Matt, they ruin it. Shit. For people now, I still hate the only goddamn thing that I ever have to deal with where it's like, I see the word like check or money order is the government. And I'm like, yeah. what are you doing? What the hell are you doing? Yeah, where's some, the like, site that some I can go mom pay and pop off? fucking startup takes fucking online payments or credit cards or whatever, but like the PayPal. fucking state of Texas is like, well, you're gonna have to drive down to town hall and write me a check <laughs> and hand it to me in person between the hours of 12 and three, but I might be at lunch for two hours, who knows? And I'm just like, what, what, that's, that's just how, that, what? That's and that person's 158 years old, and I'm just like, and then Matt's just like, my parents still do it, they're ruining it for everyone. To be fair, let the, go. the town hall in my town go. has much less people coming to it. <laughs> <laughs> it's like five people and that's it. It's wild, man. Yeah. Yeah, I, I've never written a check till I moved here. I feel like checks died a little earlier in the I, European markets. I think I, I have an out of date checkbook in my house. Yeah, somewhere. that's my I mom had, freaks out when I tell her I don't have a checkbook. She's like, how do you, how do you not? <laughs> I mean, I do that. I'm like, well, I have a credit card. She's like, she's like how, do you buy, how do you buy groceries? <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> you give her the credit card, she takes that thing, and she's like, <laughs> <laughs> like oh, there's the numbers. Super, card. <laughs> super easy. <laughs> yeah, you go like that and you need the piece of paper. They don't even yeah. have like raised numbers on a lot of them now. Like, yeah. Even if you put flat. it in one of the mm -hmm. things, it would just do nothing. Yeah. Dude, I barely wait in line for a lot of shit anymore. Like, I just do mobile pickup stuff now. Like, for groceries, I drive up to. Do you feel like life is getting too convenient? 
Well, there's, a, there's other shit. Sometimes just a no. No, no, no but... to the point where it's like you don't actually have to go in anywhere. You can just either pick it up or get well, dumped. Well, thing is that like, here's the problem. That's it's not gonna go away. Here's the no, problem. shit like that's more expensive to do though. So I yeah. feel like you reach a point where, like, money is an issue. It's more time is an issue, and yeah, then from but, there you start to weigh in like, but is this worth my time? To be to fair, that's an intelligent there. person weighing in though. People who don't have the money are still gonna do it anyway. It's true. Here's here's and this is maybe every it's single generation. Time, right? Maybe every generation has this with something. You know, some new shit's always being invented, a new way of life. You know, there weren't cars, and then there were people being like, should the people with cars are like, are we fucking lazy? We're just driving in a car. Like, we're, <laughs> I'm not, it doesn't even take me two days to get somewhere. Well, it's crazy. Yeah, um, you, you can't walk across America in like three days. But like, you know? can if you stop time. <laughs> you know what, dude? You you right. do I can do it right now. Yeah. You can do it in a minute. You can walk on an ocean. Way to bring that back. Um, <laughs> but like. I feel with so many things uh, for like me and, and my generation where I'm at, where like I love the convenience of shit because I didn't used to have it. And I just th constantly think of like, oh, is that change happening? Where it's like, like my kids, like all the shit that I saw happen, they just have, you know, where it's like, I went to the fucking grocery store with my mother every single week and it took three hours and I'd have to fucking wait there. Da, da, da. And like now I have the option to use like Amazon Prime now or, or whatever, you know, even even ordering from the grocery store, like you said, just driving up, picking it up and leaving. You yep. know, it's and still bring it right it's to just like, car. dude, that was Saturday. That was like Saturday. Half like, your Saturday you're like going grocery, grocery shopping store. with your mother today. You're going to help carry the groceries in and, and you're going to yeah. fucking just follow her around the fucking store <laughs> as she like, you know, price shops and then stand there and she scans all the coupons. Like I experienced that. So I feel like I put the work in and yeah. now I can live a life Shit. without it. Yeah. Same thing with like internet. Like there was no internet. There was internet and 56K and now there's like, you know, fucking Google Fiber where it's like we went through the phase but I'm already old and, and like curmudgeon enough where I'm just like thinking of my kids like these motherfuckers. Like, they got <laughs> iPhones. so easy. You know, they got They can fucking, just ask you there was, anything. There was somebody, somebody, po I don't remember who the fuck it was or what it was about. But somebody Rooster Teeth related. I want to say it was Achievement Hunter, but I, I literally can't remember anything. But somebody did just like post a picture of something like, oh, I remember that. And it was like four or five years ago. And in the picture, someone was holding an iPhone, and it looked like a fucking rock. Where I'm like, why? Oh, yeah, it was like this big. Yeah, it was like thick. it was it was thick, and it was like the size of a fucking stamp. The phones now are like two feet long. You know what I mean? And I was just like, oh my god, that was five years ago. Like that's, it's all happening so fucking fast, We're old, man. man. Where I don't know. I'm just like, and then I, again, I say that now, and then you know. My kids shit. will grow up and this will be ancient old shit. <laughs> you know, they're like, fucking iPhones, fuck you. You have to hold it? I'm playing Red Dead in 4K on like an HDR yeah. screen. I'm like, man, it used to look like shit. I'm gonna, like 20 years from now, I'll be like, ugh. Well, that was even, the, even the thing with like, it, that stands out the most with GoldenEye or like the N64 games. And it's like, the game does look like dog shit. But the biggest thing there is like, it's so easy to just think of like graphically now, like whatever, PC gaming or you know, current consoles, Xbox One or PS4. But it's also like, dude, fucking TVs were nothing. Like, I oh, played no. that game on a 19-inch fucking rounded television. You know what yeah. I mean? Like, the, that's, uh, it's, I mean, like, HD TVs have, like, that's, they don't make anything else. You we, have a TV, you played, have an HDV, and I, good luck finding too. one less than 40 inches. We played today four-player four, four player split screen on a pretty large TV, but it's wedged into a 4 by 3 but each segment was bigger than the TV I had when I originally played the game. Right, and in yeah. a way, it made it look better. So like, <laughs> yeah, the, the, it's small. the TV now makes it look even worse than it was. So in a way, it, it is worse than when we played it. But that, and then like the controls and the fucking controller, it's just like, it all just kind of adds up. But dude, the game started and we were like, what the fuck? <laughs> I can't see anything. What? It's so blobby. We just like, we played was, this? Like, oh. I'm angry right now. This is this. <laughs> This was the highlight of my life, like playing. I paid seventy dollars for this game. Seventy dollars, <laughs> like, like Funko Land, or like, yeah. Funko Land. Oh, you went to they Toys R Us, but you're gonna pay. You go to Toys R Us, you get the you slip, get the slip, and you ring the bell, and you he, wait for forty slip. minutes. And he comes and takes the slip, and he brings it to you. Yeah. Then you read the box like fifteen times on the, on the, the way guy, home. The guy, the car, fucking shuffles along because he just wants to die. Yeah. And he comes to the fucking thing, and he's got. The key ring with 8,000 keys because there's no key cards and he's just looking for the fucking key to the game room and he walks behind it and he's just like, 
what? And, you know, and then you slip them the little slip through the window. That was an experience. Nobody knows what the fuck I'm talking about right I now. I don't even know what you're if talking about. I know what you're talking about. Toys R Us, Yo, Toys R Us, no. the video game section was just pieces slips. of paper. Slips. Wow. So you yeah. and but but no, to a be picture fair, of the game and it's a slip. That just told you if it was in stock or not. No yeah. slips, no game. <sighs> they don't have it. Mm-hmm. And you take the slip and then you go to the front of the store and it's like a security booth. And no one would ever be in there. And there's just a Shit. button, and you just push the button, and be like, "So I'm coming to the game booth." And then you just stand there and wait. And eventually, some teenager that just hated his life would walk over, and he would like wouldn't talk to you or make nope. eye contact with you. He'd just, just stand take- right next to you, unlock the door, go in, and then go behind the glass and be like, "What do you want?" <laughs> and then you slide in the slip, and the guy would be like, "Oh, no, all right." And then just way finds the early. box yeah. and. That was exciting though. That was a process. Yeah. I didn't have sixty dollars a lot of times. No. There were know? times where dollars. We were there to get like, I don't know, like a gift for somebody else, and I would just like take the slip for a game that I want, walk around with it for like twenty minutes and be like, okay, I'll put the slip right back. <laughs> 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 we're not getting something for me today. Oh, we're getting man, something dude. for Tommy's I birthday. I don't think I aside from ones that came with consoles, I don't think I ever bought a game new. Just was like rummaging through the Oh, look at that nostalgia, dude. Uno. Yeah, dude. Like, yeah, that's, that's the slip uh, shelf. You never, you never bought a game new? No, all my, like, especially on N64, like, all the games came, like, half completed and shit. Super Nintendo as yeah. well. Like, that someone was... had, like, all of the shit in Zelda, so I just used to run around not knowing, like, what order I should have done. <laughs> yeah, that was like, I have one Majora's Mask, uh, <laughs> cartridge that's like that, where it's like, it's completed, and I'm like, oh, fuck yeah, so I would never play the real game. I just yeah. ran around with everything. I don't like, think everything. I ever played Link to the Past on a new save. I just See? used to run around the map with all the shit. Yeah. <laughs> like, I did that too, it's but fun. I had two older brothers, so it was uh, like in my house. Where it's like, I'd put the game in and someone else did work. And I'm like, oh, okay. Even as a kid though, I was stupid. I was like, I gotta buy a new. You wanted a new? I was just yeah, like, I don't know. like, I, I want somebody. Dude, I was hands yeah. all over it. I'm, I'm really like more that. like that now. I was like, as a oh, kid, I just had no buds. It's twenty dollars. I care less new. now. I don't give a shit. You know I mean? <laughs> we go the other way. Well, it's like time. I bought all that N64 shit. I wasn't like, all right, let me make sure this is a new game. Like, the, no joke. Like most of the games I bought, depending on the games, they ranged from like fifteen bucks to like thirty bucks, like forty dollars. Um, just on GameStop, and I was kind of shocked at how cheap they were. Like, wow, you could gouge the shit out of me. You could charge me a hundred dollars for a game. Where the fuck else am I gonna get it? And then I would just look just for like, uh, maybe I'll just Google it or I'll look on Amazon. And it's like all Amazon has is unopened. So it'd be like, hey, buy this used copy of Super Mario 64 for 30, 40 bucks, which is one of the more expensive ones. You know, it's an iconic game, launch title, whatever. Or get it on Amazon open for $300. And I'm like, fuck my ass. What are you, nuts? Like, you can come on the game for all I care. (laughs) I'm just going to put it in the fucking thing and then play it. Does it work? Great. I don't give a shit. That was like, um, from what I've learned, I ended up buying Mario Party on eBay because I got fucking one, two, and three for, I think, $50. It's like $55, which like those games are crazy expensive, even used, you know? They're like upwards of $60, $70 each. And uh, apparently, which I I believe, I don't know, I, I don't know if the wording was there or whatever, but I, I mentioned that, I did a bunch of posts about when I was buying the N64 games, and somebody was just like, oh, dude, that's like $300, like, those three Mario Party games. I'm like, nah, I paid 50 bucks for them. And people were like, yeah, you got fake games. And I was like, what does that mean? Like, I played them, they that, work. That explains it. And it's like, like well, well, apparently, they you can, like, like, Japanese, like, companies, just for, like, resale for this shit, like, it's, it's literally not a real N64 game. Like, if you open it up, it's different. It's basically like a remade version of the game because so it's, it's got like the it's, the, it's the game on the chip, so then they just like, made yeah. it kind of. So yes. it's just a different housing, but basically, the game chip. basically, okay. yes. But like, but there's people being like, "Sucks for you, man. Fucking fake game." And I'm just like researching it. Like, do they work? And they're like, "Oh yeah, they're 100 percent reproductions. They just cost nothing because they're new and they're made with newer technology, and you can just make them." And and people like hate them. Because it like ruins it for collectors, and I'm just like, I'm playing the fucking game. What the fuck yeah. do I care? We <laughs> yeah. played Mario Party One the other day. Did it feel fake? Was it like, I can't believe we didn't get the real thing. Like you could have paid two hundred dollars for it, this and it, played the exact same game. It felt fake to me. And in some instances, <laughs> listen, you, whatever's going on with you and Boo, that's between know. the two of you. I don't know okay? why. I, don't I why did hates. like literally the only thing I could find, and I guess like in some instances people do shitty jobs of it, and then they don't work. 
but that's a whole other scenario. In some instances, it's just like, hey, we compared the two, and it turns out the new reproduction, it runs slightly better. <laughs> I'm just like, oh, oh no! How, how dare it? Who gives a shit? Yeah, his capacitors haven't drained what away. What the yet. fuck do I care? Dude, I used to care so, fake. so much about like getting it new versus used, even when I was younger. And I think it's it's Pokemon cards that did it to me. Yeah. Cause like I would like it got to the point where I had, you know, my binder and had everything in order by number. And then I'd be like, shit. You know, I'd be at the, you know, the Chinese corner store and then I'd Pokemon cards there, I'd be overpriced because everywhere else is sold out. And I sit there and I go, Well, I only need like two more cards in the collection. I shouldn't buy a booster pack. And they have three of them right there. And then I'd like get them out of the case and I look at them and like uh, this this hollow has got a tiny little scratch here. Damn, dude. This hollow's got a tiny little uh, nick here. And I'd like wait, maybe wait a week to see if they pull like a better version. <laughs> Come back and finally pull the trigger. And then I look at my binder, I'm like, oh, this one's this one's used it's open. I didn't open this. So then I'd have a section in the back where just like I put it there to be like this. It was like I have it, <laughs> but this one's tainted, so it's in the back. <laughs> I've got it, but I don't feel good about it. Yeah. But yeah, I was yeah. I was thinking about that. I I just feel like I just get new stuff now, just from like people that are gross. You never know what's on them. Like well, I, was, yeah. I was the the new VR thing I just bought came out, and I was like, maybe people are selling HTC Vives now that this new thing's out. So maybe I get some just. And then I was like, but it's gonna have other people sweat. It's a big difference yeah. though. Yeah. I'm not that's, that's, wearing that's Mario Party. Thing. Well, yeah. that's the thing. It's like, <laughs> like yeah. that's, that's something that somebody's wearing. Dude, you buy yeah. a Nintendo Switch, somebody else probably licked the game already. You know, to see what it tasted like. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> and if it's a cartridge from an S64, they probably blew in it. Oh yeah, yeah, oh, dude, I did. I blew in it today. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. It's built up <laughs> fucking sweat and amoeba. <laughs> I remember that when that was like when you were tech savvy. If you knew to blow in the yeah, fucking dude. cartridge, sometimes like, you'd oh that guy knows. Sometimes, knows sometimes you'd have doing. to jiggle. It didn't actually do anything. Uh, no, it was, it was just bad for it. It was like fucking. <laughs> yeah. Oh damn it! I sometimes died. Sometimes you jiggled it. Fucking the Nintendo. Uh, cause I don't, I don't know if the Famicom had this, but like, I think cause it, it was different. Like, the Famicom might have, was it always a top loader? Cause it was like totally different I think the Famicom was. from the Nintendo, but the Nintendo, you put the game in and then you had to push it down, and it was like a slot, and then it clicked down. I think down. it's because they wanted it to look or feel like a VCR. But the, I don't think the Japanese one did that. I don't think so either. Um, but like, that, that was a key breaking feature of the Nintendo it was like that thing the, like the, the clicking it down so there would be like I remember even the Nintendo in my house there'd be so many things of like okay you gotta blow in it you gotta do that you gotta slide it in yeah but then you gotta push down real fast or you gotta do it like real <laughs> slow or like a friend of mine had a Nintendo where like it wouldn't work unless he put something on top of the Nintendo because like somehow the pressure of the Nintendo would make the game work where if he, it's like yeah I gotta put this brick on top of it or else the game won't yeah. play. It was like gears, <laughs> it, was it was such so a, it was such a, yeah it would like, yeah. like gear, if that thing didn't push oh down God. you're fucked. You I'd really have to one. wedge something in it to keep it down so the game would read. It was a whole thing man. Jesus. I mean that kind of thing carried all the way over to the 360 I feel like. People used to have to play those with a towel wrapped around yeah. it to Dude, avoid the I, I tried to do that to fix one of mine. <laughs> to like resolder the Yeah, I'm just right? like, no, don't back. resolder it. You just, you it get just... a warranty at GameStop and you bring it back and you bring it back and you bring it back you bring it back. I went through five original Xbox 360s. Dan used to do a thing where nuts. he would buy a brand new console, take the new one out, put his one in and then just return it. Fucked up. Some some kid in really? Christmas opened up broken, a X, a broken ass Xbox. <laughs> and but also like, how does that? Do they not like check the serial number on the console? I mean, not when you return it, won't we'll match not everybody up. Does. You're fucking but stupid. Usually it was like this. Take it out. Yeah. Usually it was. Yeah. Here's your money back. Yeah. That's how it went. And then they moved not away. Everybody. So <laughs> I remember. I remember. I mean. <clears throat> Not nearly as major because there's just cables and shit, but doing the opposite to an extent. I had to return so many fucking 360s. So GameStop offered, they offered a like personal store warranty because there was like, you know, the manufacturer's warranty, but like good luck with that. You know, like you get an Xbox and Red Rings, it's like, oh, this technically isn't covered or like, or like even if it was covered, I knew so many people where it's like, yeah, I sent my Xbox in, and then they said maybe yeah. in three weeks it'll get fixed. And it's like, oh my fucking god! It, like, it I takes just, about. A month. I just want, I just want my goddamn console back. And the GameStop warranty was like twenty bucks or like thirty bucks, and it's like, bring it in, we hand you a new one. <laughs> and like you could, you had to buy the warranty when you bought the console, but every time you brought it back, if it broke, you could buy another one. So I just, yeah, just kept spending thirty dollars. <laughs> 
Because I'm like, I, who knows? Like, you were paying yeah. a subscription to Xbox. Basically, yeah, yeah, basically I put the down payment down for the console, and then it was $30 every six to nine months. But it was still just like, oh, broke, go to the mall, here's my Xbox, take the new one. But it got to the point where literally I would just unplug my console, take out the fucking hard drive, bring it in, go, can you just give me this? Like, I don't want the cables, I don't want the fucking hard drive, I want any of it. It's all hooked up to my house. Like the fourth time I brought my Xbox back, I'm like, you can keep all the new shit. Can you just, can you just <laughs> yeah. take an Xbox can, out can of the box? The Xbox. Too much yeah. Yeah. Just the shell. I'm tired of switching then, out the cables. Yeah, they just be like, okay. I'm like, that, hey, you get new cables? It's just give me the fucking thing, okay, yeah. bye. There was a thing that happened with the original Xbox. I'm not sure if it happened here. Do you have the thing where the, the Transformer brick had an issue and they replaced it with one that had like a pop test switch. No. You like thumb the thing in I didn't. and pop it back out. Like one of those. Like a GFCI. Yeah. About. It was like that, but with like a red and a green. No, I never saw thing. that. It that. might have just been a UK well, thing. Well, I, I do know there was a thing where those would like blow up or like set on the fire or something. Get the bricks. Stupid hot. Yeah. yeah. And they would send you one of the, like a. I never saw one of yeah. those. Yeah, that's just like unleashed a memory. I don't think I've thought about that since. Someone was <laughs> early two thousand. Yeah, yeah, like, like, well, remember that thing? Someone in chat was asking about used PC parts. Do you ever get used PC parts, Gavin? Uh, it got used RAM before. Yeah, I think there's certain things are just like it's totally fine. And also, like I think if you buy it like used, if it's within manufacturer's like warranty, and you f you want you're okay dealing with the whole contacting them and sh you know shipping that stuff back, and you're good. But other than that, yeah, I would usually either buy used or just. Deal with broken shit and just like do other things <laughs> with my life once stuff broke. I feel like I just buy new because I don't want to. Because like if something breaks in your PC, it's like, okay, what is it? Let me troubleshoot for like half a fucking day yeah. to figure out. It's like the RAM's not slotted. Yeah, it's nice something. to not have to rely on secondhand stuff. For sure. How you get on that? I, I don't think getting drunk was the right choice. We told you it wasn't. <laughs> no, you passed the sweet spot. I think he's passed well the sweet past spot. You might re enter the sweet spot as you come we'll down. see. On We'll see, buddy, but I'm probably gonna have another drink. <laughs> I had one of what Gavin is talking Should about it? for the OG Xbox. Yeah, what was that thing called? It had like a weird name. It's Michael, I could never have done that many refurbishings at GameStop. Because I, I went through like three or four Xbox 360s, but like I always sent them back to uh I never sent to Microsoft. Back. I sent them back. Get, it takes what if, forever. What people, it takes what a while. Call it's like, so it was like the like Xbox casket or coffin or some shit. They, they would send, like send you. you a box yep. and like yeah, put your yeah. dead yeah. console in it <laughs> and fucking say goodbye to video games for a month. Well, Dude, so that's the thing. I, bought, the I, had, I had two Xboxes because of that. Like I had one, and I was like, okay, I bought another Xbox. That's see, fine. See, it's your just whole a other rotation. Xbox that was the cost of five warranties. I never had to wait. There you go. I had it right there. And then, like, whenever I wasn't using it, like, the girl I was, like, kind of living with, I'm like, yeah, you can you can play that when I'm not using it. Oh, easy. <laughs> like the girl you were with, with was a, she was a grown adult. Yes. Okay, it wasn't just some small child. From no, it was, it was, no, I mean, she was... I, yeah, I was never smart enough to get the warranty, so I was always sending it back, and there was a time where, I think it was, like, a year where I had to just deal with a broken Xbox and try and get work around it, because I was, like, I was first getting into competitive gaming, and it was like with Rainbow Six Vegas. So then I was just like, I can't be out of scrims for a whole month. Like, what am I gonna <laughs> do? Like, this was, I was like, damn it, I got matches. <laughs> I gotta scrim these other teams. It's soft, got... dude. And I was, like, I was like, I couldn't. So I just kept like fucking like, wrapping soft. it in a fucking towel. And... Go do it. See, I never did any of that shit. Go do I, it. I was like non tech savvy in any way, shape, or form. I wasn't opening anything. I wasn't anytime ever, ever as like a kid or a teenager, I'd be like, all right, maybe I could. Oh, I broke it. <laughs> like I open, a, I open a controller and fifty pieces fall apart. I'm like, oh, I just throw that in the trash. I'm never putting that back together. Trying to buy a new controller. So I learned at one point to just not ever do that. I was yeah. just like, nah, it's, dude. I opened this Xbox. It's dead, and now I voided the fucking warranty because the little sticker got peeled and the holographics on it. And it's like, he opened me. He opened me. He's like, hey, hey, he opened me. Don't exchange this. No, it it is like, funny. Hey, no. Workarounds to problems are often quite funny when. Uh, Dan, it was like before Dan and I started mm -hmm. Slimmer Guys, he had his nan's old car and she crashed it on what on the, the passenger side door. So he got a new door, but it was a different color. It was from the same model of car, but from a different color. But he didn't connect it right. So the oh, lock, fuck. the lock on that, on that door didn't go up when he unlocked the car. So the passenger couldn't get in until he leant over and like manually pulled the thing up. Then it was really cold one day. And he pulled the, the handle on the driver's side door and it just snapped because it was frozen. The plastic <laughs> thing snapped, so it, it was like. <laughs> so he had to 
get in his car by unlocking it, getting the back door open, leaning in, flicking the driver's side door open, getting in, and then leaning over <laughs> top. And it was like, every time we just did that, it was the norm to get in his car. And nowadays, we'd be like, oh, we'll just go and get it fixed. <coughs> but at the time, it was like, oh, yeah. we don't have any money. Yeah, I don't so have money to do that. Like, like, you just don't people would to walk lock by. up to try and fix it yourself. Yeah, eventually he had like a, a piece of wire that he could open it. <laughs> that was, that I think was, it was fixing a, it. I think Dude, it was the top of, a, the top of a coat hanger bent Damn. on a long wire. So he would open the back door, pull his driver's side wire, <laughs> then lean over and open the they back door. They the shit out of it. What happened? He's breathing heavy. Matt's breaking apart. I, it, what pisses me off the most oh, is like I've gotten further, but like only once. Did we see it? I don't think you did. No. Oh. No. Oh uh, no way. Maybe it'll be it it everyone. Look at Matt play right now. Maybe it'll happen right now. Matt, you're gonna have to keep playing this after the podcast. Well, that's a oh. funny thing you keep saying, but it's not. There it right. is, I mean, Matt. Dude, the funny thing about it, Matt is you want it. I Go do back. want it. You want this, dude. He aced that part. Look at this. Ooh, this is it. the furthest. Oh. <laughs> Is that a new game? Is that a new one? No, you do that before. Have you fallen down that hole before? I have! Yeah. That's the worst part! Fuck, dude. Ugh. Damn, You were great up and then drunk kicked it. Like, ah, I'll put this ice here. Just like, slid Damn, on over. Dude. Into that hole. Oh. Fuck, oh, man. Right. But like, what he just did, that was two hours of the stream this morning. Yeah, yeah. dude. I yeah. just looked over, and he was like, ah, I'm doing it. And then he jumped down a hole. <laughs> Which was a very questionable decision. I feel like new consoles are much more reliable. I don't think I've had a one break or a one X. I feel like the X. Xbox 360 generation was the worst one. They were fine before that. I never once had an issue with like a fucking Nintendo 64 or like any of my old shit, yeah. Game Boy, any of that shit. That was just like, hey, check out this new thing. It fucking sucks though. <laughs> it's gonna yeah. blow up a lot. Well, it was like the was laser, like, damn, dude. the laser disc thing burned out a lot. That the laser like, disc. Fully. Well, not the laser. You know the fucking don't, optical eye. Don't. That, sorry, I'm not really doing words well because I'm drunk. Uh, I thought and you were also, you thought you bought a laser disc player. Yeah, I was like, it's not that drinking. It's just the Mario. It, it, it actually could playing. just be the Mario. He was. Dude, Matt bought the HD DVDs oh, and he attached guy. it when to there was the, a war between Blu-ray and yeah. HD. Yeah. Yeah. You know, so I was an Xbox fanboy. So I was like, fuck Blu-ray. We've got this. Let's do this. And I have this peripheral. We lost really badly. <laughs> Why do I own this? It's Betamax all over again. Oh my god. I think I think it, VHS won one, that one I because think, of porn. Oh yeah. Porn doesn't porn sway like Porn swayed to VHS. Yeah. So basically VHS won. Now porn's on the internet. Dude, yeah. yeah. That's why everyone has phones. That's why. <laughs> that's it. Yeah, that's. If Anytime you see someone on a phone call, you're like, what are you doing with that? <laughs> if the next, if right the now. next iPhone blocked Pornhub somehow, <laughs> it would not sell well. Oh, it would not. You're right. Please do an ad read. Okay. Thanks, Eric. <laughs> when did he record those? How old is this thing? Eric, what is your favorite color? I don't know. I don't, I don't know. know. <laughs> he couldn't have said like a color to prepare for that question. I'm that was fucking stupid. <laughs> I mean, carry. I wonder how many there are. There's probably not that many. We've already heard a bunch of them. Please do an ad read now. No, you're gonna answer my question first, Eric. When did you record these? Don't tell me I don't know. Don't fucking tell me I don't know. You push something that makes no sense, and I'll accept it more than I don't know or I don't know. <laughs> do it. <laughs> 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 You shouldn't have to choose between overpriced designer sunglasses and cheap shades that won't last you this summer. That's why I'll never wear anything other than movement sunglasses. They're an LA-based accessories brand that has hundreds of premium affordable sunglass styles to choose from. So whether you're into more timeless shapes like classic round sunnies or something that makes a statement like 90s skinny frames, they've got them all. Constructed with durable, acetate and lightweight materials for that perfect reliable fit you don't have to choose between style and function you get both sucker and with their free shipping and returns policy you can try on as many styles as you want right from home uh fredo's rocking jeremy's i think they're the maverick brand right dude, now dude i it's, feel like a maverick dude, you, like you, talk on you me. probably fly a jet right out of here if you end this podcast you'd be tom cruise but i'm not saying you'll turn into tom cruise if you wear them but i'm not saying that you won't turn into them i feel like it. you know i'm like, just saying still cool though and you look cool 
Uh, make sure you lick them before you give them back to Jeremy. Movement sunglasses start at $60 and no pair prices over $95. So you're guaranteed to find a style that you love with quality that doesn't break the bank. They've sold over 2.5 million products across more than 160 countries and their collections are always expanding. Get 15% off today with free shipping and free returns by going to mvmt.com slash off topic. See why movement keeps growing. Check out their expanding collection. Go to mvmt.com slash off topic. Join the movement. Uh, maybe fly a jet. You know, we don't know. It's not gonna let you fly a jet, but it's mm. also not gonna stop you. Mm. You know, the I'm choice is you yours. Need, you need aviator shade. You don't want the sunrise coming down. You Look, have you ever seen anyone in the history of time fly a jet oh, and not Kevin. wear shades of some kind? Yeah, I haven't. Sun beating down. Shades down or like because, goggles like I said, or whatever. Know, they got good. I'm not gonna lie. These actually look. Until some, they look, dude. They ball. I'm feeling it. Yeah. You know Yo, I'll tell you what Jeremy's doing in San Diego right now, burning his eyeballs. Yeah. Because those are sitting on his desk. His eyelids are getting first degree burned. Idiot. Birds. Little idiot. Nah, he's cool. Did you beat him at? Nope. nope. You scolded Gavin as nope. he came in. Did he walk right in front of he you? He walked right in front. And yeah. like, he, Matt is, he meandered for I a I can't bit. tell how much it's the game beating Matt down or the alcohol, but like, he's like, he's getting sluggish, he's slouching okay. more, his well, head's I'm, I'm going more, down on his shoulders. Well, that's wrong. Like, <laughs> He's Phys physically given up. Does oh, Nintendo it's... have a cloud save thing yet? Yes, it does. How do I get Only that? for a few games. <laughs> this is what Matt sees when he closes his eyes. <laughs> <laughs> this is unfortunately what Matt sees when his eyes are open or closed. He is in it now. Depends on the game. Oh, look uh, at it. It does depend on the Dude, game. Dude, Nintendo still, I feel, is like the only no! company. Nintendo's the only company, like, in 2019 where they're like, we're not sure about this whole internet thing. It might blow up. <laughs> yeah. you know, we don't want to invest too much in the online or cloud saves or you know who, what, digital storage. You know that's you know that's a flash in the pan. No, we don't wrong. know that people are going to be playing games online next year. I They're realized, fucking stupid. I realized they that was first have their but they're like a paid subscription <coughs> service with like last year. Yeah, for yeah, multiplayer for online. online last year. Damn yeah. it, I got free for the time. I feel like I'm they, playing too much Stardew Valley. Because the other day I saw a truck that was delivering wood, and I was like, who sells wood? But it's like the laziest thing you can put in the bucket. <laughs> <laughs> it's like, it cuts down trees and sells it, and then I was like, oh, in the real world, that's a really important job. I, just <laughs> now when you were saying it, I didn't know if you were talking about Stardew Valley or real life. <laughs> yeah, I was talking about the real life. When you said I saw yeah, someone real selling life. wood, and I was just like, in the game, or are you talking about like Shit. a lumber yard? I was like, real, you can sell much life. more valuable stuff, you use the wood to, oh, yeah, <laughs> it's like real life. Life. what are you doing? <laughs> like, what are you Lazy. wasting your life with? You're not you gonna get out anything with What are you gonna do with that wood? <laughs> Build a house? She just started selling <laughs> geodes. Watch out, because that one bitch will take your you. geode. Dude, you can get some geodes? star fruit. You, you just gotta fix the bus. And then this is one you, uh, the, 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 let's, the Stardew Valley Let's Play that we did. Some chick was like, I really need a geode. And then I took forever to find it. Found it. Bitch took it and just walked away. Bitch took it. That's how she like is, she probably, You probably got a little bit of heart from, Yeah. From I didn't get shit, Gavin. You probably, she okay. liked you a bit more. I was, you know, I was afraid of chanting it up. Was I was that, about to take out my was, earrings that was and the, start That was the coffin. start of Fredo chant, wasn't That was the start. It? I wasn't in it, yeah. but I remember Lindsay telling me Something about it. Something I did once and stuck with everyone for way too long. Welcome to a Damn it. <laughs> hey, Tower Who'd you marry? Uh, I married Leah. Leah? And uh, I, got, I got to level uh, 124 of the skull mine. Oh, shit, dude. I married Abigail, and I have to give that bitch like diamonds and shit. Damn. This is what she wants. Dude, just get some. Is she likes, your wife she likes, like that. She likes purple stuff. What's Damn. the name of the thing? The crystallarium. Just make diamonds. That's just actually what I did. It's it literally what I did. Was like I've been cloning diamonds or whatever. Oh, so you're giving her like the the man-made diamonds? Uh, yeah, but she doesn't know. Dude, that's, that's the thing. <laughs> if you don't know. They're the same thing, they're just fucking way cheaper. Or you spend the same amount of money, bigger diamond. Ooh. You know? That goes back to the fake cartridge thing. It's like, that's a fake diamond. It's like, what's Damn fake about it. it? Well, some guy made it. As opposed to what? The earth making it. <laughs> How's it different? It's not really different at all. Well, it's the just... resale value is the difference. But the resale value is different because it's people go, I just found that one though. One's an investment. <laughs> It's what? rare because he found it. I'm just saying, but like, but like, if you were a fucking alien that came to Earth and be like, like, they're both diamonds, and be like, yeah, yeah, but that'd be like if someone gave you a twenty and a fake twenty. 
Not really, because it depends if I can it'd spend be, the it'd be 20. like if someone gave you a fake twenty that you could also buy things with. Yeah, yeah. That's what he's saying. <laughs> like, what do you do with a fucking diamond ring? You wear it, and it looks like a diamond, and it is a diamond. And he's like, oh my god, that diamond. Did you find this or did you make this? Because fuck you if you made it. <laughs> it's just like you, you like you you like it because look at it, look at it. That's why you're wearing it. And they're like, let me tell you how much I paid. Someone found it in a mine, though. So, <laughs> yeah. you know. Well, it's they, a, a blood they still have to, like, shape them and shit, don't they? I'm just saying, though. I did mean animals. I'm just saying. It's, it's it's the same argument, though. Just, like, it's a collector's thing, and it's just, like, legitimate versus reproduced, regardless of what the thing is. But like, regardless also, of the end result, it's the process. But it's also for rings, right? Isn't it? Or, like, diamonds, isn't it? Also a point where, like... The human eye can't perceive it or whatever, so it's just like, why go past that? That's why I say you about like, no. like clarity. <laughs> oh, that right yeah. there, that means he's not wrong. Some guy goes, I know, because I know. <laughs> Who knows? Some motherfucker, maybe you. Some motherfucker puts a thing on and goes like this, and he's yeah. like, holy shit! I, I, Matt, I've printed so many diamonds in Stardew that I've got like 800 that I just walk around with in my pocket, and I just give it to everyone, because for most people, <laughs> You just get some like wow, you have to, money like, bags. You don't have to like go around and be like, oh, this is some, some like it's a truffle. You just yeah. give everyone diamonds. But some woman, whenever I give her a diamond, she's like, mmm, delicious. How did you know I'm talking about? <laughs> like, well, don't eat the diamond. <laughs> Why are you eating diamonds? No, it's fake diamonds. She, so she can just eat it. She like a fucking like 1990s fax machine. Just, <laughs> <laughs> like downs it. Damn it. I'm friends with a dwarf now. And uh There's dwarfs. Little... Have you gone to the point where like of other crazy Stardew Valley players, we have fucking spreadsheets and shit. Mm-mm. I don't even grow crops. Oh no, I just yeah, fill the greenhouse with star fruit and I just go about my business. I don't even farm outside. Damn. I pick the shittiest farm layer. I pick the water one, so you actually oh, have yeah. like no space to do anything. It's just water that's completely. <laughs> well, what useless. does it matter? You're not even fucking building a farm. That's why I don't farm. I was like, I wanted to have this like a big elaborate farm. It's like I don't fit. The slime hutch takes. I don't up have none of this land, so I can't farm. So I just use the greenhouse. And I put all my star fruit in those basement cask things that take so like, like two, two seasons to make a billion wine. years to make wine. It's a fun game. It is. Damn it's, on the, it's on everything, right? <sighs> it's yeah. Abigail. Yes, it was Abigail. She eats my it. diamonds. That's probably <laughs> Abigail. Yeah. Damn, dude. everyone knows. That's my wife. <laughs> you bleep her out of this. Yeah, Abigail is here. like that. I'm lost. <laughs> I got no. I don't. Damn I can't it. do Stardew. It's too. It's too. Just like. Just do whatever you want. Yeah, I'm that's like, like no. Give me, give me some. Tell me no. what to do. Who do I kill? Who am I slaying? Is there is there a and fucking like, time sh- limit or something? Yeah, they're actually know, what, kind of it. What am right? I racing against? Yeah. Oh, just do it. Live your life. Like In like, it's, it's I just like, I just can't do those like yeah. free form. Like, well, it's a game that's like son, oh, kill yeah. shit. You pop the game so open. Stuff. Yeah, but the thing is, like, then I'm just killing it because it's like, ah, you can. It's like killing shit in Minecraft. Like, no, what's the point? you progress like, further not? down the mine. You get better shit at the bottom. But yeah, what's the point? What's the point of the shit? Just, they're just to like, make hey, your grandpa happy. Here you after are. <laughs> live your life. It's like I'm already living my life. I want to get to the goddamn dungeon so I can get the hook shot. I want to get to the next dungeon so I can get the structure. Bone arrow so I can get to the next dungeon and then shoot that in the goal. Give me a round and how many rounds I gotta win? Who I have to shoot so I can get that elo? Get the casino card membership thing card. What's that thing? Oh, you said card thing. Card? It's a thing times. to get membership into the casino. Card. I don't Try remember. and get that. Oh, actually, I do. Okay, great. Because that, <laughs> that, that takes, that takes a, a long while. time. Yeah. That's like a lot of slitting, a lot of loving. Wait, you can kill people in that game? I just like... Well, not people. Not you can people. kill like... I just never... I Damn. never got into those like Stardew like, Valley, uh, Earthbound, Animal Crossing, like... Dude, Animal Crossing is the best. It's too chill and at the same time busy work. It's games where it's like, oh fuck, I gotta do all this shit for no reason, and it's stressing me out. <laughs> it's not for no reason. Yeah, you gotta make buns. But it's for me, Dude, it's not good enough. There's uh, not a good enough reason. Like, I, am I gonna I get make buns so I can get like a new gun to shoot? You, get, <laughs> you can you know? meet, go meet the witch. Am I playing fucking Wolfenstein two? It's like, why am I playing it? Because I'm gonna fucking kick Hitler in the face on the moon. Kill some That's monkeys. what I'm gonna do. Boom. You know, because the game's been out for a while. I'm gonna get my head cut off and put in a new goddamn body. That's true. Okay. Grandpa will give you a purple cat. Is that true? How do you get a purple cat? Listen, listen. Be I'll be dead. honest. If Grandpa gave you a purple cat and then the credits rolled, that would be enough. Because <laughs> right? they'd be like, "You beat the game." After like you, you got did, the purple you got cat. Purple cat. After that like doesn't happen. Three it's... years, Grandpa comes and's like, "How you been doing?" Well, I got that. He gave me three candles. I can't light the fourth one. Don't know how to do it. Ooh. How do you get the fourth candle yeah, it? Turns, it turns out just you suck. Matches, I'm not good. Dude. But I guess you better restart. <laughs> that's Look, actually, you chop that's down the wood, you carve it out, really? and you yeah. farm some fucking I don't know, coal. That, that and then Grandpa has judged you. 
You can just put a diamond in it. He judges you again. Oh, okay. I know that part. Oh. <laughs> for, for when I played it, it was like, Grandpa judges you in three years. Tough shit. I shut down that shitty Jojima. That thing's a little Oh, yeah. I turned empty. that away. No idea I got rid of it, too. They're on. You don't know? They're I really... You play the game. They're what do you mean? I played it once. Once? Let's play. Yeah, but you still, you were chatting up the fucking storm a minute ago. Yeah, because the bitch took my geode and I'm still See? not over what's it. what's a geode? I don't know. Don't, don't come at me talking about rock. geode, then look at me and go, I don't, I don't know what I they're don't saying. Fucking You're part of the problem, And then somebody nerd. took it. No, I put it down and I stopped playing it. <laughs> problem, I didn't open nerd. up a fucking spreadsheet and start figuring out what, what best season Well, no one opens up a spreadsheet. There's a wiki article. It's much easier. You kick Hitler somewhere. It's Mars or Venus or something. You go to outer space and you can kick him in the face and it's. An I, I gotta look up this purple cat. I gotta see how to get. <laughs> Michael, you should you should try Dragon Quest Builders. It's like Fuck the relaxing you. shit, but there's quests and Here's stuff. Here's what to I would play instead. Well, characters Matt, look like I would play Dragon things. Quest. Look That's like what I would play. Dragon Ball Z characters. Okay, I just wouldn't play Dragon Quest Builders. I'd play Dragon Quest. Oh, it's a statue of a cat. Oh, it looks cool there. Uh, oh my! <laughs> you better. He turned into Rocky for a second. He's like, yeah, it's a statue of a cat. It doesn't say how you get it. <laughs> Grandpa Shrine. Oh, yeah, it must be like if you get a really good evaluation. Man. Wow. That's all I want to go. You've got a purple cat. It doesn't really have, you know, like an ending point, and you get judged <laughs> for how you're it, living your life. It does. It has it like does a, give like a three year time limit to be game. good. Three year time limit. Yeah. So, wait, there is an end after three years. I mean, no, technically, there's going. no end. You do whatever you want. Never mind. You've kicked right there. That's the end of the conversation yeah. for Michael when you say there is no end. No, three years <laughs> is the soonest you can get. That's the way. same reason I didn't fucking play Pokemon Go. It just goes forever. And I just watch these people drain their goddamn lives. You I played Pokemon. You didn't play new Pikachu Eevee uh, one. Well, that's hey. Pokemon Go Plus. Hey, of course. That, that some people need to sense. catch it's new friends. Good. That's a built up version of Pokemon Go. It's called Pokemon Let's Go. Yeah, but it's the game. It's like it's not the game. It's, it's not, not the game at all. It doesn't have like, it's like Pokemon small Yellow. No, it's not. You fucking lunatic! <sighs> it's literally a small. You go all the same places. But there's no oh, game. That's great. It's still Pokemon Go. It's still like you know what's fun in Pokemon? Fucking battling and catching Pokemon. You know what you do in Pokemon Go? That's what you do in Let's Go. Yeah, but yeah, it's the world minus the game. There's the game's still people there. People that need to catch new friends. The, wild the game is, is still there. It's just the most of the you game still fight isn't Pokemon. there. It's crap, Not, though. Yeah, you fight the Pokemon when they're someone else's Pokemon. Yeah. You can it's only Pokemon beat light. the shit out of things that have love from other things. It's, you it's, mo it's like 80% of the game. No! no it's you're a maniac! You're it's a the whole game lead. except you can't hurt wild Pokemon! That's, you are an absolute insane maniac person. Uh, it is the only not the whole you can game. Hurt are, uh, it's, it's the Moltres, minor part of the game. Articuno, and Zapdos, and okay. YouTube. Yeah, the legendary shit. The, yeah. the yeah. game in a game is gameplay, not look, it's the same towns, okay? The <laughs> gameplay is not there. You go and you fucking like, hey, I'm gonna fucking, uh, I'll throw a, a food at this thing so it stays. <laughs> just like a fucking game, right? And you just, you, you know, in Pokemon, the where you just throw game. Pokeballs at it it's without like, fighting it's it. It's like the Safari Zone. But it's the thing. Safari Zone sucks. I hated the Safari Zone. You, that, thank you. It's the worst part of the game. They took the Safari Zone, and it's the whole game. Pokemon Go is Pokemon the Safari Zone. And then it's just like, look, 400 million fucking Rattata. Great. They're everywhere. <laughs> They're fucking all over the place. I would say... <laughs> It's, it's not like for me. Seventy-five percent of the game. That's and I'd call you a maniac. Matt, okay? you were pretty upset that you can't transfer. That's your, fine. People want to play Pokemon it. to the next Pokemon game. Yeah, yes, anyways. don't get him started. He's already doing. He's it, upset with this. Why? Why you got to poke the fucking? But bear? this is, dude. It's his friend. Dude, it's his friend. It is. No. It, that's <laughs> you know. I, I wanna I wanna be able to take my Pokemon from the last game to the new game. Fuck me, right? That's basically the internet. That's but how half but people like. Say it. Is it time to move on, though, man? I don't give a shit about that. My friend is arguing you. both sides here. He's like, Matt, those are your friends. <laughs> Matt, get new friends. Get new friends. <laughs> uh, it's honestly, I'm not upset that, like, if they were to do, like, a clean break where they're like, yeah, we just can't, for whatever reason, get these new, or, like, these Pokemon to the new game. I'd yeah. be like, all right, I guess that's that's it. Yeah. That's really shitty. But they're like, oh, no, you can have the ones that are in the game. But you can't you have, have the new ones. ones. Well, no, but if you have an old Pokemon yeah. that happens to be in the new game, like... I have an old Tyranitar. Yeah. Tyranitar is in the new game. Yep. You can take your old Tyranitar to the new game, mm. but you can't take your any of your other old Pokemon that might not. Oh, be I mean, in that's the new a game. lot of friends to like <laughs> build, Shut and, the hell up. build and make, man. Like but, you got to render all those friends. 
I, I, you know, if they weren't using the models from like the old fucking games, maybe you're right. Maybe they could do it. But I don't know. I get there's a lot of a lot of depth time and shit like that, but you get it. You just don't care. I understand. <laughs> you just want you want, want your want 700 Pokemon. Pokemon you've caught. I knew this is a real issue with Matt when it was a multi-thread tweet. Hey, fuck you! <laughs> Let me tell you why this bothers me. <laughs> but and, you know, like. I don't want to blame like devs or anything like that. It's definitely like crunch time and shit. You know, they they got to get the game out because they've got like a whole franchise, like anime and products and stuff like that. But uh, it doesn't mean I don't want it. I well, I mean, maybe I it's just Nintendo's way of like helping you grow up. You're the one like, who straight up was like, "You can't leave friends. <laughs> you can't leave friends." Well, because he's playing oh, both I'll, sides of the argument, yeah. Matt. He just wanted to see that. what you'd have to say about yeah. it. Okay? Yeah, I know. What if he Nintendo was... took your Pokemon and shot them? In front of <laughs> That's wow. great. I'll throw my Switch in the trash. Awesome. <laughs> Damn, it would have upset him. I would also, to be but fair, then, I would be both Marvel because be like, "Oh my God, you made him real." How'd you do that? <laughs> and then they shot him. <laughs> no, they oh my God! Gun. Why did you do that? Yeah, they're like, "Why would you? <laughs> why?" I'm I'm excited for Sword and Shield. Are you I, gonna go Sword or Shield? I mean, I probably go Sword because I like chopping things. Yeah, so if you too. can't uh, fight while putting, but you can. That's why I'm excited. Yeah. Yeah. That's why I want it. Why it, it, it it's also why I, then I wouldn't like it. It's also why he, Sun and Moon was fucking stupid. It was like, oh yeah, no gyms. I'm like, but well, that's the game though. That's what I want to do. I want to run, and they're like, yeah, but look, the fucking Vulpix is blue. Let's go, has gyms. T to be fair, I don't the the trial things were essentially gems. Mm. They were just like I mean I I mean I played it. I didn't like it. Yeah, no, and that's that's the thing. If you that's, play it, didn't like it, thing that's here. all you. I don't sit there and play Pokemon Go and go. I hate it. Eh, it's just not. It's just I don't play yeah. it because I don't like it. Well, that's so why. That's I, when Pokemon Let's Go came out. People were like, Oh, are you gonna buy it? I'm like, No, it's Pokemon yeah. Go. You just walk around in it. It's the same game. Well, well and that's about? and people are like, It's well, Pokemon. You, you just don't battle. Battling is fucking ninety percent of the game. Battle. You battle like a schmuck, okay? Mm -hmm. Give me my move list. Give me, let me fucking grind wild Pokemon. Let me Give fucking run through the grass. Have you played the game? Yes. Well, and see, that's actually I played that game and with like the hope that I could be like, yeah, this is a self-contained adventure, and I don't, I won't miss all my old Pokemon or whatever. After it's I beat friends. the game, <laughs> my old friends. Yeah. <laughs> After I beat the game, I was like. I don't give really a shit about this. Yeah, like it's, this, this see, is. See, I'm with you. It'd be before fun I beat the game. That. Yeah, I just didn't play the whole game and, and it's beat like, it. It's like I'm at the point in it's Sun and fine. Moon. I play Sun and Moon every fucking day, like or Ultra Sun and Moon or whatever. Every day is a lot. Man. You make I, it sound like it's because yeah. every night I, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna go to sleep. Let's uh, I'll play a little Pokemon and then fall asleep, and that's it. I, I'll like make a new Pokemon. Hang out with his friends. Whatever. Yeah, that's, that's it. Dude, I'm, I'm playing. I'm playing my like mind games with Jackie and po with Pokemon like Sword and Shield right Is now. That right? Because like mind games. Well, I mean, because we're both you know we both have we switches. You know, it'd be dumb to, for both of us to have one version. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? Like, yeah, you, get, you each get a version. You trade Pokemon across. Yeah. And I was like, all right, I want Sword. She's like, ah, oh, I really want Sword. And I was like. I was like, damn it! Like we both want Sword, and like I don't want to back off, and so. A couple days later, Tag is like, oh man, that's Shield Pokemon. It's like legendary. It's awfully cute. And I was like, it's so I just been saying it like every other day. I was like, that Shield Pokemon looks so cool. <laughs> like, just imagine how powerful it is. You're like the defense stats must be so high. Like, it's just so sick. Now I just got to the point, just like, stop it. I know see, you want me to do it. See, here's what I would do. <laughs> I see yeah. what you're saying. I would go the opposite route. And I would go, I'm getting sword, so you can also get sword, and then you won't get the other Pokemon, or you get shield. I said I don't that she care. didn't care. I, well, I, but the thing is, I really don't care either. So I would just be like, okay, well, I'm getting sword. I'm like, okay, so am I. Cool. And that's the end of the conversation. And then and then Jackie breaks and gets shield, or she doesn't. And you move on with your life. Oh, I gotta I gotta manipulate that mind to get the shield. I'm like, it's so cool. <laughs> like it's you so start cute. solo, and by the end of it, you're like, <clears throat> shield. <clears throat> yeah. I'm like trying to. Just sit there. Sit there. Whoa, maybe I'll get shield. Yeah. Huh? <laughs> That's what I do now is I make it that obvious. I'm like, look, I'm going to get shield. There's nothing you can do to stop me. And then, and then if I were Jackie, I'd go, great. And then I would pre-order sword. <laughs> hey, Eric, how's it going? Good. Yeah, baby. <laughs> that didn't work. That, Come on now. That one's so gross. Come on now. They, you didn't have one for how's it going? You didn't have like they also weren't ready on they, the bus. They weren't ready. It was yeah. very delayed. 
You need one like, <laughs> you need one like, what's up? You know, or like, uh, it's good. Hey, Eric. Yes. <laughs> You're trying to figure out how to stump him, but all <laughs> hey, it's going to be is, I don't know. Matt, did you beat what? it yet? Yeah, I did. No, I didn't. Dude. I'm dying. Do you think Matt will beat this level, no. Eric? No. No. Yeah, he had a yeah. no. He's got to have a no. That's a pretty default. I was confident when we started, and then Matt started drinking. I don't oh, they keyed out the back. That's oh awesome. God. Oh, that's actually the... really cool. That is Matt. Now you're just fighting yourself. He looks really good. You're the boss. That looks awesome. What the fuck? Wow. Damn. Dude. Damn it. And I just A-B-B-B. fucked it up. No, you can't look at that one. You gotta look at <laughs> that one. No, no. That's, to, that's so more impossible. Have, it's like it rides the perfect play. line between like you have to play looking at your cringe. own face in They're the background. Just fun. They're just having fun now. Maybe if Matt, maybe it'll help Matt to see how fucking just defeated he looks. <laughs> <laughs> the coolest thing you've ever Oh, dude, Shit. you no momentum at all there. You knew that bike was gonna know, get the best the of you. Why does no one stream on there? Twitch like that? Do, do you think? that just be too cool? Because they don't have a whole broadcast. Yeah, that's the whole broadcast. Shit, Eric. buttons. Do you Why think, don't people do you think stream Matt's... on Twitch with an Eric's voice box? Yeah. Do you, do you think <laughs> Matt's gonna go home right? and tell his friends how hard it was today? Yeah, I'll be like, hey, what's up, what's up, Swampert? How's it going? I didn't beat the level. It's okay though. This it's even is worse what Alfred is doing right now because oh, like fuck, man. this is that's a continuing yeah, conversation is. we had in the office when Matt wasn't here. Like that's what? like that's why he's really digging deep because we were talking the other day. Somehow Pokemon came up and I was like, dude, Matt's really upset that his friends can't come to do Pokemon. <laughs> I am, dude. So it's like that's why Alfred is bringing it up. Where like I can hear the cynicism in his voice, like Matt, your friends though. <laughs> This is a conversation that Matt Fuck wasn't you. a part of, right? <laughs> but Matt, as angry as he is, is still agreeing with no, you. No, I, I completely agree. He's like, oh, you're making fun of me? Fuck you, it is bullshit, though. <laughs> now Alfred, Alfredo's boo, now. He's taking your coins, Matt. You gotta I pedal, mean, you gotta pedal, Matt. It's, it's mostly like the, it's the fucking thing where it's like, <laughs> I've had that those shit things for like 17 years, dude. <laughs> I don't want to get rid of it. Great idea. Someone said they should do it again, but every time you die, it goes grayer. <laughs> <laughs> Matt, maybe this is, but maybe look on the bright side, right? Like, you're so attached to them because you had 17 years, but like, okay. Nintendo's giving you a clean break. That's true. Against your will. Fredo, what if someone gave you a clean break from your hands? Would you be cool with that? Clean break from my hands? Go. I don't look at my hands as my friends. Well, that was a weird comparison. <laughs> I'm also Are not. Are you gonna poke on your hands? Hey, Matt's just like, I need this! Did you collect your hands? Them, right? Also, it was a very, very, like, uh, I caught my aggressive, hat. like, was, Matt might like, break your pissed. hands after the podcast. <laughs> he like, he's like, oh, what if I get a hammer? You know? What about that? Bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, damn it. You almost had it. No, I didn't. It's okay. I know. I'm it's just trying okay. to help you out, man. Just trying to throw you a bone. Good effort. You getting hungry, Matt? No, I'm all right. Uh, no, just say yes. Okay. Yes, I'm hungry. Dude, Very hungry. Let me, you know what would be great to fucking satiate that hunger? Boo. What's up? Blue Apron. Oh. Did you say Boo Apron? No. Oh. I didn't. I said Blue Apron. Blue Apron. Yeah. You've said, dude. And then, <laughs> and then now we're here. But let me tell you about Blue Apron, because nothing, literally nothing, in the universe says summer's finally here like a classic juicy burger, whipping up a fresh tomato salsa, or sharing a delicious meal al fresco. This season experience the joy of cooking something new, trying new to you techniques, and making cooking fun again with Blue Apron. Blue Apron helps me discover my inner chef and learn new recipes and techniques. I love how easy it is. Love how easy it is to use. I've been eating Blue Apron for years, literally years. I had it three times this week. I'm having it again tonight. Blue Apron has turned me on to some delicious recipes I wouldn't have thought to try. They have a sweet pepper focaccia pizza. It looks absolutely delicious with Blue Apron. The hard parts are done for me, and I don't mind cooking. In fact, it's actually fun to learn new skills with each meal. The best part about Blue Apron is like they send you everything, and like you get it all. It's all uh, you know, it's fresh ingredients, um, and they they do they give you the little stuff I wouldn't bother with, right? Like when mm. I'm hungry and I like you know I'm gonna make spaghetti, or whatever. I go into my pantry, I take spaghetti, I boil it, 
you, I, you're lucky I add spaghetti sauce. You know what I yeah. mean? It's like you can add more stuff, but it's like I don't have one like, onion to chop. I don't no. have. You know what I mean? Dude, what they goes, got it all, What flavors go with what? They got like, it all in there, man. It's like boom. They give you an it. onion with the meal. They give you the spices. They give you like a sauce. You can you know make yourself easily. It's just like it's 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 my version of like when you watch a cooking show and they yeah. always have everything. You know, they open yep. a cabinet it's, and it's, it's just all there. Has the ingredients. That's Blue Apron. It's all in the box. So it's I absolutely eat more. Uh, variety, right? Of like, of like different meals, extra yeah. spices, extra little stuff. Dude, they always have like killer cheese. There's always like some kind of like goat cheese or like extra like fresh Parmesan cheese. Or I'm a huge cheese fan. I love it. Um, fresh had, Parmesan, dude. I had pasta last night. It was mm, pasta with uh, chopped pork in it. It was uh, basically like you know, like if you have a chopped meatball, but it was pork. It was delish. Blue Apron helps make cooking at home an easy part of my weekly routine because of my hectic schedule. And it is hectic! I felt like I had no other choice than to go out and eat more than I should, which is true. And I got real fat because I ate fast food too much. Um, but with Blue Apron, I actually have time to cook delicious, wholesome meals instead of relying on takeout to start making delicious, brag-worthy meals at home. Ooh. 1G. Without the hassle, try Blue Apron. Check out this week's menu and get $60 off when you visit blueapron.com slash off topic. That's blueapron.com slash off topic. Blue Apron, a better way to cook. Also, yummy way to cook. Yum yum in my tum tum. Have some blue blue. It go goo goo. Matt fell in the hole again. <laughs> did he while, really? while you were eating that. Damn, dude. That's, that's You need to fall in the hole of fresh life. eating. Yeah, I'm gonna, oh. I'm gonna fucking cook. Fresh eat. I'm having chick I'm not, don't fresh eat shit. I'm having chicken tonight. It's my yeah, last baby. Meal. Yeah, baby. Yeah, <laughs> baby. Wait, okay, now seriously, Wendy. Wait, what up, guy? I'm coming That's to wish you. That's the dude. illusion guy. I'm coming to wish you happy birthday. Okay, it's early. Is it is? But there's not gonna be another off topic. That's true. Now and then. Is so, it like this week? This is your birthday. It's Wednesday. Oh. Woo. You didn't know that? He's gonna be forty. Yeah, dude. Yeah. Almost yeah. thirty-two, yeah. man. Thirty-two going on. Hey, creeping up. Yeah. Dude. At what point do you just round up? I feel Not like 32. 33. You rather 35? 33. I guess. Dude, I don't know when it happened, but like, I don't know. I feel like you have this. Kind of, yeah, it's, it's crazy. It's, listen, Matt is. Gone. Everyone should stream like this. <laughs> you see, they're really, oh, are you playing this? Yeah, this yeah. is yeah. live. He's been playing this since noon. Noon, trying to beat this level. We streamed from uh, noon to like 2.15, and he's been playing it now here since 2.30. Okay. If you do it right, it's like a minute, right? It's like it's 40, like 40 it's, seconds. You have 49 yeah, seconds to beat the level. Yeah, yeah it's, so. uh, it reminds me of, uh, what is, uh, what's, the, what's the last episode, or the last uh, level, the bonus level on uh, Modern Warfare? Oh, Mile the play yeah, one. Mile, Mile High, High Club, yeah. yeah. And that's like you gotta get a minute, like a minute of perfection. Per yeah. per That's not yeah. even enough time to reload. You just have to like pick nope. up shit you find along the way. Yeah. Flashbang and run. Yeah. And just go you just through memorize there. where everyone's coming from. And then, I wonder if I could do it. No, Jeff isn't almost fifty. Jeff is fifty. After yeah. a certain point, you just round up. It was crazy. I'm fifty. It was crazy when he passed you. That was nuts. I know. Who would have thought? He was like, hey, hey, little guy. There was a point in time though where our, our age gaps were like way different. Like Gus was like the baby yeah. of the group. Now we're all the same age. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I, don't know, I don't know how that happens. I have no idea how that happens. That was, Just that go. was, I mean, I feel like that was the way when we had like lads and gents, and now Fiona's like seven. <laughs> you know what I mean? I'm 32 yeah. so with two young. kids at home. That, that one was like, that, Look, they're like, all embarrassing. I remember when it was a deal that like, I'm, an old, I'm a year older than Gavin, and two years older than Ray. And I was like, what? Who gives a shit within Doesn't 10 matter, years? Doesn't matter, man. The time goes. Why is fucking Jack was like latched onto that like just, nobody's just business no about how old he was. was? What is the gap between Jeff and Fiona? Because that's the what? biggest gap. Matter. Okay, so Jeff's... You're Jeff's, Jeff's, Jeff's 40. Jeff's 44, and I think, I think Fiona's like 22. I think he's double her age. <laughs> so yes. two Fionas she's, is she's one like, Jeff. Yeah, she's oh. like 22, 23. Huh. Yeah, but let's look. Like, I remember like, like Gus... Right, being like the youngest, like of the founders, like is he? I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I, don't know. I don't know either. I don't know. Yeah, we never knew how old Joel. Yeah. I still don't know how old. I don't Joel count is. him. Yeah, I we'll count that. I don't know how old he is. I he's literally a, don't know. Two thousand. Do you know? Sure. Uh, don't, don't say it. You'll I don't die. Think they had birth certificates then. Um, <laughs> <laughs> it was a stone tablet. But like, <laughs> so we cracked in half. Gus, Gus is as older like than I am as I am to Fiona. Please. Go again? What? He's oh, like nine the same years thing older than me, and I'm like nine years older than her. So now that's how I know. Like I'm just I'm old now. I mean, she's like I'm in the bracket. Right? She's twenty-two. 
I I thought they were talking about uh, someone was about a hole again. No, 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 and not be the only thing we were talking about. We really kind of shunned him. It's okay. Uh, He's to, just, really to just playing it until we brought it back with the when Alfredo just hammered him about his Pokemon friends. <laughs> oh, I, don't, I don't get why. Like, why would you no also <laughs> hammer me about it? Because like they have several services for the exact fucking thing. He does like, so well. Uh, he's angry. He's that was a like, shit. <laughs> <laughs> It's he really like he's looking at you I'm and he just the, sees a big floating ghost. Dude, I'm in the danger zone right yeah, now. Hey, you're so not that, safe. <laughs> is, there, is there a thing in esports? It's like in traditional sports when someone's having a really good game mm -hmm. that nobody looks at them or talks to them. Well, like a perfect game. Like a perfect. So when a pitcher's throwing a perfect game and everyone yeah, just stays just the just fuck kind of, away yeah. from you, nobody says a word to them. No, you kind of just let them. Well, you kind of, it's a mixture of both. You let them do their thing, but then you kind of just ride with them as a team. But you, you don't, you don't call time, attention. Yeah. 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 Are you coming back for November burns? Are you gonna have November burns? Could, could you December burns? Oh damn. Oh, burns? September burns? Oh, yes. uh, well, you're gonna have three. We're not gonna do all three. You know what you do? We have a choice here. Og burns. <laughs> <laughs> I, uh, I, I, I'm having a kid, or I'll be nearby someone who's having a kid. Right. That's, That's true. You don't have to do much. I, you know what? I've never been through the whole like uh, the whole labor thing. Both the, the I don't know if it's too personal information, but I mean it's yours. My so. the first two kids were born cesarean section, so we just showed up at the hospital on a certain day. So now I'm in this thing where it's like literally two weeks from now we're on the clock. At like yeah. at any point in time we could be like yeah. ah, we have the whole how, thing. What's two, is it like eight months? What's two weeks? Or is that, are you at nine? So the due date is end of August. Ooh. So we're about to be at 37 okay. weeks. Is yeah, that's 37 oh, yeah. to 40 yeah. is yeah. any time. It's just like any point. Shit, just so we, should, ready. we should shoot all of November this week if you want to do November. Yeah. Really well, definitely yeah. I feel like if he's got the kid in August, like November would be fine. Shit. Four months. How long is months? Paternity. I just mean being like, hey, can you come in and film three videos? Like, what? I had a kid three months ago. <laughs> <laughs> Should we make a bet whether or not this you. kid will have a license before Gavin does? <laughs> okay, What's the point? It'll Why? Be, it'll be this level of Mario. <laughs> okay, all right, let's not throw yeah. the Mario <laughs> Damn. Matt, well, the Mario Damn. Matt, <laughs> Matt can still hear you. Unless he has another drink. You what know? is what, so? Why is this one a big deal? It's Mario it's one one. Yeah, with it's a just some sicko. It's just sick. it's just incredibly you know? difficult. And this is but I've seen this thing like a bunch of different places. Yeah, it was all over. It, just my the week is world this. one level one. It just looks like a cloudberry level. And then the weirdo cats trailer yeah. that everyone's freaked oh, it's out about. So why did I jump? Why do people care uh, though? It's like a, it's like it's, it's something to talk about. A Broadway musical from the eighties. Like that's you know, what I was saying. It's just weird. It's for sixty year old ladies. That's what I'm saying. Like, <laughs> like, like, people now are just I was we talking about it already, but they're like, oh, it's just so weird. I'm like, the original was fucking weird. It is. It's, it's a Broadway weird show. Yeah. Yeah. People, people dress up like cats. Yes, yeah. Same thing with the, the Will Smith genie was blue. I was like, oh, he's blue in yeah, the movie. Yeah, he's he was blue the whole time, and it's like, it's like, wow, I can't believe they turned these cats into people. It's like, that's what it was. Why are you shocked by this? Fuck so you. Who was like, who is on the internet now that was like <sighs> really invested in this 80s yeah, Broadway like, musical by Andrew Lloyd Webber? Can't wait for this to come out. I can't stand this. This is too far. <laughs> 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 My drama club childhood has been ruined. Oh, it's a good run. Back. It's oh, a good it's run. A good run. He's when he goes backwards, he's the speed. You know, he's got it. He's the jump. Oh. Does Jack have a yeah. strong opinion? Because I know Jack's like up end. everyone's butt about Hamilton. <laughs> Does he care about this cat thing? I don't, well, he's not here. Oh no, no, not Hamilton. Is there a Hamilton movie? No, he's up everyone's butt about that uh, Book of Mormon. Oh, that's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. That's like his favorite thing ever. Everything, yeah. It's Wrong. like one of those Jack things where it's like he likes it. And he's he, got a couple. He makes everone else he hate it. away by liking it so much. Yeah. Yeah, so it falls. You ever heard of? Right. Rrr, 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 rrr. And you're just like, rrr, rrr, rrr. no, I like that thing. Stop. No, I, I see watch you guys do it in the office a lot. Mm -hmm. He starts talking about something. He's like, I don't know. I'm tuning out. Peter, oh, yeah. just telling me the you problem isn't it, that man. it's weird. It's that it's not the same weird. We want the weirdo cats. They're they want weird, real they're cats. They're, they're, they're weird. Cats. weird? 
You gotta so move on. on Broadway, right? You gotta move on. It's a good run. It's a good run. I guess run. they wanted the non CG. Why did you, you call, call attention to him? And then I immediately fucked up. <laughs> I'm really sorry he did that to you. Thank to be you. fair, you, you were already. You didn't attack. You were already at a certain speed. <laughs> I just thought I could come on off topic and get you guys talking about Broadway musicals. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> for the second oh, we, time. Yeah, we brought it. We brought it again. Yeah. <laughs> Bro, that was weird. Were so, you guys hating, hating on it? I assume. No, is it CG cats? No, they're just cats. Yes, it's like but the Mike Myers like Cat in the Hat one. Did that freak you out? It, was, it felt less were, CG like it was more. Well, it wasn't. Yeah, it wasn't more, CG yeah. though. Was it? it wasn't. It was just Mike Myers. I mean, they they like it. But people didn't like that. That was the only word to say. And then, and then we started but talking I about. I also think it was just a bad movie. Yeah. That might be then we were talking about Tim Curry as the devil in Cock Legend. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking amazing. That's one of the best makeup ever. Yeah. That's what, why crazy, don't we, can't we yeah. still do that? You can have CGI. I don't think actors want to do that. They don't want to see the shit. Commit to the craft. All right. There's just a Netflix movie called I Am Mother where they got a. a I haven't watched that yet. Guy in a robot suit. It's pretty cool. Oh, That's I Rose watched it. Burns. I liked it. Rose Not Burns. the guy in the suit. She's the voice of the robot. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. Yeah. I, I, it was one of those movies I started watching it. It's like three actors in that movie, right? Yeah. It's just like. It's so like far uh, for me. post apocalyptic with the one it, not robot it? mother. Yes. Oh, okay. But here's why, though. Because I'm I started scared. watching it. You guys are in relationships. You know this. Mm -hmm. I started watching it on Netflix and then I realized like 20 minutes in. Ashley would probably like this, and if I watch it without her, I'm gonna get in fucking trouble. Yep. Oh, damn. See, I, yep. I have just, the But if you watch it something without phone. you, Matt's you're calling not me. in trouble. I have to go talk just, to Matt. Just, oh, okay. Just, 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 just be lucky. Uh -huh. Ooh, I didn't hey, know Dad, you needed <laughs> Did he say, hey, Dad? Yep. Uh, yep, yep, yep. I hate you get to talk to Eric. <laughs> yeah, I was yeah. gonna bring it up, but I mean, I don't, I, I don't know how long this, this thing could have been, has this been Eric for the last, like, six months? Because I wouldn't know. I don't see him. Are you kidding me? Yeah. yeah. No. Are you kidding me? Yeah. Did, did he do just <laughs> two of every <laughs> line? Like they were, they were, do the soundboard and he did a take and they're like, we need another one. Like that one wouldn't cut it. In case someone doesn't believe it. <laughs> we need to sell this lie. Now, all right, now we're just gonna go until Matt beats this. Dude, we're gonna so, be here so for We've done the ads. Buckle in for the weekend. We've done yeah. the ads. Um, I mean, you guys could just let it roll. <sighs> I mean, he could beat it in the pusher. He could, but like oh, that's got a very show. short limit. Like the podcast could go forever. Post show is like fifteen minutes. You know I, what mean, I mean, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. You know. Plus, like people sure. are invested now. They're watching. You know, they're not gonna. They can't see the post show. That's Why don't we just stream. continue on Monday? Why don't we stream this forever for, until just you for do forever. it? Because we'll never do it. Well, well, here's no. He'll do it. Here's the problem. Matt's gonna beat it tonight at home. No, I'm not. Yes, you are. Matt, there's no way you put four hours into this and you're not gonna beat it. Sometimes you just put four hours into your life and it's just wasted. Yeah, but not you. Bottom You'll do it. A hole in the table. Matt, I'm not confident in you for most things, right? I yeah. see something I'm not like, Matt will overcome the as adversities. This I am. This is like yeah, you'll this is like this. Matt doing Crash Team Racing. Like, <laughs> I'm not practicing. I'm just playing it for a week he's straight. He's literally been doing this for four hours straight. I'm impressed that you he's haven't had like a, He's had like a 15-minute break. It's maddening. It reminds me of like when the I played Bloodborne. Fuck. First guy, the first thing he said to me Fuck. was after the stream, I was like, dude, you played that two hours straight. He's like, that didn't even feel like two it hours. It did not yeah. feel like two now hours. Now it's running on him, though. Does this, did this, this feel like this two feels hours like an and hour. 20 minutes? This feels like an hour an of my life. That's great. That means he's got Yeah, you still got Yeah, you still got more in the tank. If we've been going two hours and 20 minutes and this guy says it feels like an hour, who are yeah. we to take that away from him? That's true. Hey, you know? it's just broadcast. Not, if Matt can do it, you can do it. They're okay? not broadcast. They're not I'm doing not, anything. I'm not making on them Friday. do that. They don't care. They want to see this guy be the level. Don't answer. Don't say anything. Just I watch. think Eric can answer. <laughs> Please stop. <laughs> <laughs> really, stop. Stop. I can't. Stop shit. Please. Stop. That's all four stops. He needs Damn it. Five stops. stops. He needs some sort of like That was the one the, he the, the, thing is, the thing is they sound Six. real. They sound real but not together. Yeah. He needs some you need to get some sentences from him. Yeah. Right? Like you can hear it's like start and stop and start and stop. He speaks like a robot. Are you if saying you yeah, baby is in a sentence? <laughs> no, <laughs> yeah, baby sounds fine. Yeah, baby. That sounds real. <laughs> but you can't do yeah, baby and then two or three more right after it. That's when it falls apart. How many yeah, mm. babies did he do? Just one. I think. Yeah, I think, uh, he nailed that one. Not just the one. He didn't have that yeah. and, I mean, that It's not perfection. that he didn't nail it. It's just you need variety to fool the human. Listen, I've got a meeting. 
you still here though. Dude, something <laughs> you had a meeting earlier. Something there is just going like this. Just, like, just fucking can you God play damn. them all on top of each other at once? Oh shit! How many fingers you got? <laughs> yes. Please stop right hitting here. me. <laughs> stop are you me? kidding me? Don't do that. I'm in the game. Are you kidding me? Stop hitting me. 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 Gavin! <laughs> there is a walkway back here! There really you is. can There's do a, that! Yeah, you can, you can take you five more you know, seconds! You know, Fuck I, you! I've been doing this for hours! You can take five goddamn seconds back. and I can be. This is why we can't stop! This is gold! Shit. That was this the is wrong. gold! Into the post show! This is Let's Matt do it. yelling at Boo! Right Let's there. do it! No! Alright, well. Boo. Um. This was the it. podcast. We had Bernie stop by. Matt almost sort of did it. I, I've uh, made one little bit of progress, and that's it. one little bit of progress, but like, he didn't quit. Hey, but, I'll know. tell you that, he kept playing. Can't stop He's died stop. time and time again. Matt's out there digging holes, falling <laughs> in, <laughs> climbing out. <laughs> You're in hell now, Michael. <laughs> <laughs> You're in hell now, Matt. <laughs> Uh, well, he did, if you're, if you haven't watched it and you were just listening, Matt didn't beat the game that he was playing. You're That's nope. the short I, version. Yep. There's some possibly um, hard. And Eric's not actually, one level Eric's yet. not here, if yeah. you didn't know that. Um, I'm in the control booth. Yep. Nope. That's Are it. you? That's a new one. That's a new one. I'm right here. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> like again, that's the same one Fer- for the outro. That's the pure yeah. Ferris Bueller. Where it's like, hold up, hold hey, up. make sure you record one that says you are here. <laughs> you're you're <laughs> in the control booth, right? You're in the control I'm booth. Over here. Right? Okay, yeah, cool. What color shirt am I wearing? You have eyes, right? So you should I don't know. know. The bullshit, you don't know. You know. I don't you have know, eyes. Dude. Why don't you open them, goddamn piece of shit, and tell me what color shirt I'm wearing? Damn it! That's <laughs> yeah. Okay, now we need to wrap yeah. this up before you say yeah. something he regrets. Okay. I don't regret offending the computer. Oh. Or the soundboard. Sorry. How about Alfredo? He's about to. Do you regret yelling at him? Not really. Okay. <laughs> All right, go. let's go. Yeah, heard it here first. <laughs> okay. Hey, thanks for watching. We'll be back next week for another exciting episode. <clears throat> Maybe Matt will still be playing next week. Who, who knows? Who know, well, only Matt can Damn answer it. that. Oh shoot! Got the money well, again. Hey, bye. You can end it now. I've done the bye. Several times. Bye, baby. <laughs> <laughs> <laughs>